Good morning. Good to see y'all this morning. Got a little tray of goodies right here. <laughs> Carla P, Lynn, CDJJ, good morning. Kathy V, good to see y'all. Come on in the house, y'all. Get you something cold to drink. So good to see you. Miss Carolyn Davis, good morning. Oh, yeah, thank you, Mr. Man out here. Gonna be helping him this morning. Gonna be working on his boat. Hey, Miss Charlotte. Miss Macy, Pamela. Tricia. From California. Miss Eyes 512. Good morning. Shannon King. Kathy V. Hello. Get word of son ain't on you like that. Yeah. Yeah, the sun's coming through. There's Miss Rachel. Good morning. Thank you for that beautiful shout out you gave me yesterday. And Grandma and Daddy, I told them about it. That was so sweet of you. Thank you so much. Remember me telling you, Hodge? What is it? Miss Rachel gave us a five minute shout out. Yeah. Like, I mean, it. she was saying your, your channel and your link and what days i was live i was i can impress me i didn't even know she knew all that i can't even, i can't even keep that straight myself sometimes that thing's ready for business ain't it yeah today we're gonna be installing Mr. Man, some brand new LED lights on this boat. Every now and again, like you gotta, uh, we have to go off topic of building, and which actually, this is a, uh, this stuff is custom built. Mr. Man himself, he built these brackets. He ordered these lights for his boat, and uh, he built these brackets. The whole of them. I'm talking about like looking brand new, like you could actually send this out with the lights um, and sell them like that. <laughs> so good. Yeah, like he he designed the bracket to hold the light that's removable. What in the world? Now, you know what I mean? Just he's always thinking outside the box. Matter of fact. He tears, he's one of them that tears the box slant down. Just, uh, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna be soldering today, this bad boy right here. I, I do it. That's our soldering wire, this is like, um. <laughs> well, hello, Poppy. Miss Green, good morning. What you need now, wire cutters? Uh, I'm just thinking here a minute. <sighs> oh, y'all, I got a new shirt. Look at it. Got a new shirt on. It's got a guy backpacking. Nothing back up. <laughs> Miss Ellen M sent this shirt. Thank you, Miss Ellen. It fits good too. It, it's uh, it's soft. It's a pretty color. Yeah, it fits real good. <laughs> now I just gotta try not to mess it up. Hey, Sandra. Wilts County boy. Good to see you. Danny, they saved you a little bit of salt. A little bit of what? Salt. I don't know what you're talking about. Good morning, Crystal. Good to see you. 
I just, it's, oh. Uh, well, it might be because I've been moving around, but it's warming up out here. Just V5. Good morning. That's a brand new one on me. Cheryl Canada. Well, thank you. Miss Brenda Jordan, Janie Jane. Danny lost weight, no sugar. That's right. Hey, he's... It's, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like melting down off him every day. They can tell it. Y'all can yeah, tell it. Yeah. I lost weight. Yeah. Women get mad at us men because they lose their boobs and their butt first. And, like, they don't like that. They don't like that. But, hey, uh, we don't usually... We don't usually have a problem. We... We seem to slender down quick when we trying to. Hey, Stephen, I'll add something to the about the women. Yeah. Losing. You might not even know this, but a lot of, when you quit smoking, you'll gain weight. And a lot of women don't want to quit because they know they'll gain weight. Yeah. Smoking. Did it say? Let's have a Yahoo, y'all. Did it say? That's proof cigarettes are key. <laughs> Keep from getting fat. <laughs> yeah. Miss Sylvia said, good morning, gentlemen. Hey, good morning, Sylvia. I'm struggling bad. Sorry, Michelle Bailey. I'm sorry you're struggling. Quitting smoking starting to be iller. <laughs> and that's one thing people that don't smoke don't understand. People that smoke like to smoke. I don't care what they say. Yeah. If they didn't want to smoke, they wouldn't smoke. You lost weight, Danny. No sugar. How? Hey, uh, yeah, that's... Man, that's just from cutting back on sugar. Yeah. Like, and I, I'm, I'm real hard-headed, too. <laughs> uh, if I set my mind to do something, I'll do it. 4 a.m. in Hawaii. Oh, gone. Stephen, we got a letter the other day. And I was ragging to him about I got a letter. Dang. And I... I read part of it, but I was out here doing something. And yeah. I figured I'd, you know, when I went back to the house after I got done, I'd read it. Yeah. And uh, I was ragging to him about a, a woman sent me a letter. <laughs> 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 and whenever I read it, I realized it was for Mama. Oh, okay. About them tabs, about them canned tabs. Oh, yeah. That's funny. Miss uh, Bailey says she took a bad fall in the hospital. Who's that? Michelle Bailey. Hate oh, man, that. she has a time, don't she? Yeah, I hate to hear that. Man, she has a time. Dave and Cher swapped it up on us. They, they sent up. When they found that mystery man was cutting out his sugar... They was sending these every week. Broke my nose and teeth. God, dog. I hate to hear Man, that. Dang, that. Boy, you know that hurt. Well, like total fat is uh, half the, is half the grams. Is it? It sure is. Um, sodium, 100 milligrams. Stephen. Well, there's a lot of this. How's chocolate milk better for you than this? Like on the back wise. Sweet, I, I guess. Yeah. Oh, uh, I got something on that. Like a kind of a curd event. And you need to mention your curd events. Okay. Tell them about when you went to the grocery store the other day to, to buy some milk. Yeah. Yeah, like, that was pretty wild. I went to the grocery store. Stephen, you slammed that Yahoo down. 
I like them too. You may get you one. Uh, no, uh, I got, I got me some coffee here, son. Don't forget to tell them about the milk at the grocery store. Yeah, I went to the grocery store. Um, let me tell y'all what happened. I went in there where the milk was. And I seen they had gallons of chocolate milk for 50 cents. Whole gallons. And I'm like, man, that's that good chocolate milk, too. <laughs> and, uh... I looked at the date on it. Well, the date was good, but the only problem is it expired, like, the next day. So, that was the last day on the shelf, and they had, like, I don't know, 10 or 15 gallons of it marked at 50 cents. And I didn't buy any, uh, much as I like it. I just didn't buy none because it was at the, right at the expiration date. But, uh, so then, like, I seen... They had half gallons for a quarter, same date. Well, then I looked at the white milk, because I'm like, you know, what's going on with the milk? Well, <laughs> well, they had, like, whole milk. It was five fifty-eight a gallon, and it had expired the day before. So, it, they was actually five or six of them on the shift that had done expired. Like the previous day, they were still in the cooler. And they wasn't marked down. They were still $6. Um, so, you know why they had that milk marked down? I mean, you know what's behind all that. What's that? Does anybody know what's behind the milk sitting on the shelf? I give up. I'll never know what happened. I'll stop asking. What do you want to know? Go ahead and ask it. I'm looking right now. Tell us, that, Danny. That milk is sitting on the shelf because of inflation. Yeah. The price finally got so high, people just ain't buying it. And there's enough people that ain't buying it that's what it, that's what it turned, that's what inflation does. And, and that's, that's the same thing about raising the interest rates, the Fed raising the interest rates. They raise it up so it will slow things down so things will come down. That's right. Do so you understand why that milk set on the shelf, Stephen? I understand. I don't know that Somebody says it's too high. Yeah. I mean, I don't know that Tammy was even buying on milk uh, at $6 a gallon. Tell me about it. Miss Janet Jane said it's going to get a lot worse. Well, I heard it was. I heard it was. You know, we're already in a recession now. But, uh, you know, some people saying it ain't. But it is. Hey, Miss Smith, good morning. But they, they expecting it to where it is going to be like a depression. Yeah. Is what I heard on TV. That's right. <sighs> Stock up, Kathy B says. Hey, yeah, there's they, more preppers than than you would ever believe. This world is so crooked. PJ Manley, good morning. And just in case y'all don't know, that gas, that going up on gas, that's what got the ball rolling. Yeah. You know, they, it's more expensive for the trucks to buy that diesel. Right. And and the us the consumer too. Y'all, I sent out a package yesterday. I sent out a chest to Miss Diana in New Zealand. I ain't never sent nothing to New Zealand. Uh the shipping on it was eighty two dollars to send it to New Zealand. And uh that woman at the post office said, 
are you sure you want to send that? I said, I said, well, that lady won it. Like I have little giveaways and that lady won it. I said, it just so happened like she was in New Zealand. But of course, like I sent it, you know. Yes, I got tracking on it. Hey, I don't have no idea when she'll get it far away as it is, but I got tracking on it, and, and if I say I'll do it, y'all, I'll do it. So that lady at the post office says, you you send stuff all over the world, don't you? I said, it kind of looks that way. <laughs> Someone's getting rich off stupid gas. Yep, I can tell you who it is, but I ain't going to do it. I think what we do, what we got here, Stephen, is a little uh, too much for... Uh, the video? Yep. Uh, because you're thinking on the fly. Well, I don't have no problem thinking on the fly. Like my thinking on the flies, no, no, I ain't, I ain't never, I never run out of something to say. And uh, see how slow this is. Yeah, soldering it. But, but the thing about it though, when you solder that, and you, you connect it like that's it. That's ball game. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do, you know. What are you gonna do? <laughs> oh, you hold that right okay. there. Might wanna shine the camera here. All right, we're gonna shine the camera here. <laughs> so, y'all ain't no good at this. I've never hardly done it. Well, soldering, like it ain't, you ain't got to be no genius. Like when it's stuck, it's stuck. So, this needs to be an edited video. Got it. Because you, you know, you, you, I know what to do, but it, and that's the problem. <laughs> There's a lot. And you're going to be climbing off and on the boat. Have, have, you, have you heard of Texas Gal? I haven't. Ha, 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 what? Have we heard from Texas Gal? Somebody asked. I don't think I've seen her this morning. There's Miss Pamela. There's, there's Diane. I got your, I got your chest mailed out, sweetie. You'll be getting it. I don't know how long it'll take to get to you, but <laughs> it'll be coming. I got you something we can do. All right. Um, uh, we can get in the motor home and ride down to the river and like us do uh, a road trip. A road trip? Yeah. We can. You can ask them if they want to. <coughs> hey, Stephen, did you show them your picture? No, I didn't. I got to go get it. So good to see y'all in chat. Let me go grab it. Hey, y'all, this is the problem <sighs> with... Uh, it, you know, uh, about lives. Hold on just a minute, y'all. What's the thing? I think I was talking about uh, 
this is the problem with live videos. And that's, that's what grandma's always kind of trying to tell y'all. Or uh, that it, the, they lives ain't, don't work real good with projects and stuff. But she can do it. But this right here that we doing with the lights is a lot of, uh, of boring stuff. Let me show y'all this. Daddy ordered me a surprise. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> it's a wrench set. And let me tell you what happened. Oh, uh, there's a funny story behind this. Here's the wrench set that he had. Okay. So if this is yours or mine. That's mine. All right. This is the wrench set he had. The problem is, uh, I have a wrench set that looks like this too. Like, I mean, just about identical. Like, uh, where this is a pyramid, mine's a little square. But if you ain't paying attention when you grab them, you'll think it's the same. But so when we cleaned off this table right here yesterday, the other day. These wrenches got put in my truck. Like I thought they was mine. And uh, Daddy couldn't find them. He looked for his wrenches everywhere. And uh, got mad. Hey, like got mad and ordered a whole nother set of them. And then like realized they's in my truck. When I went out there to get that mic. Yeah, he, went to, he went to go get the mic out the truck to put on here and realized there's my wrenches I've been looking for. So he think I took his wrenches, you know, they clearly like, look just like the ones I have. So anyway, Miss Ellen, I see you on there. Look, I got your shirt on you, sent. Miss Ellen must be rich. Must be, must be rich. What, got three or four houses? All right, I want to show y'all like something I'm best thing I ever done. Uh, one of the best. One of the best things I've ever done. You want to make sure you say that. Yeah, yeah, obviously. I don't want to get in trouble, but this is a picture that I had made for Mama, and I gave her this for Christmas. This is me and little man, and it's a 3D picture. But, uh, hey, we just, we just laying in a hammock, and a little man's laying on me. I was, I was resting, but, like, he's so, um, uh, he, he's so on the go that, like, I was resting, but I had to have my hand on him to make sure he stayed there. <laughs> He'll make a run for it when he stays. He'll make a run for it, but I gave I gave Mama this right here for Christmas. She cried, y'all, when she seen it. And it's just a simple old picture, but it's a lot. It says a lot. The picture says a lot. And... Did you hear that? Was that the, like the start of a crow or what? I don't know what that was. That was pretty pitiful chicken sound. Thank y'all so much. I'm very proud of my sugar man. I'll get him today. I'll pick him up from school. He's so excited. He don't know it yet, but I'm taking him out to eat. Um, I need to see if Mama wants to go. You want to go eat with us? What you talking about? Go out to eat. My, my brain done got over you. Oh, did it? Every picture tells a story. Yep. Y'all, I love my mama, daddy, my grandma, my kids. I love my animals. I love my YouTube people. Um, they all dear to me. 
and it sounds funny, but like they hardly is no outsiders. Um, if you in my circle, if you in my circle, we close. And if you're not in my circle, then we don't even, you don't even hardly know me. That's how I am. But Stephen, what did they say about the road trip? Because if we are, I need to cut the air conditioners on. Or you can just build something if you want to. I don't know. Talking about in a few minutes. Right now? Man, like what? Man, crank it up. I don't I know if even, they want to see that, you know. I ain't even got to ask. Crank that, crank that mother up. Must go. Hey, it, uh, let's let it cool down a minute. All right. Go ahead and get that cage and show it to Grandma what I was telling you. She can put her bitties in. Miss Diana, yes, I got those. Uh, you didn't have to send me that. She's y'all. The sweet lady that I sent the chest to New England, it was eighty-two dollars. Hey, she sent me the, she sent me the shipping on it. So, just want to clear that up. I hate for somebody to win something and then 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 pay the shipping. Cause like I do it, cause I want to do it. But, but she did. She, she sent the shipping on it. So thank you for that. I got tracking on it. So be looking out for it. And Tony Z, uh, Miss Joyce, y'all be looking out for y'all's gifts. I mailed them Monday. Today is Wednesday. Hey, so like, it's priority is two to three days, so y'all be looking out for it, y'all. I guess we going on a road trip. Hey, like, I told you I don't never know what I'm going to do. <laughs> Farm Y, did you get my email? Hey, I got your email. I have not sent your package out yet. You you was the last package that I had to, matter of fact, it's inside packaged up. I just got to put your address on it. Where's my gift, Stephen? <laughs> hey, I hear you. I'll send you something. Ain't, ain't. Fill her up, let's go. Did you show Grandma the cage? No, I hadn't showed it yet. I didn't want to walk off with you gone. Okay. Uh, I I want to tell Grandma something right now. Let me go get the cage. Grandma, we're going to leave in 15 minutes. And y'all, I'm always thinking, I'm going to show y'all the house that we lived in. I don't think she's ever showed y'all. Right before she bought this out here. Here's the cage for your bitties, Grandma. It's got holes where they can't get out. You reckon it'll fit through the door? Which door? Her, her, her look, the one you put the door on yesterday? Yeah, yeah. You know what's funny? I'm good with numbers. Uh-huh. And her door was 23 inches wide because I measured it. Hey, that's cutting it pretty close right there. This is a this is a 30 by 19 by 21. And what you say to there what you say the numbers on? 30 by 19 by 21 and her door was 32 inches because I measured it. That door was that wide? Yeah. Well, it'll fit through there then. Yeah. I measured it because I had to build a frame for it. Tell Grandma to come on down here and ride with us, Steve. Grandma, put your shoes on and jog down here unless you come with us on the... Or tell her <laughs> that we'll come pick her up. Yeah, we'll come pick you up. How about that? Coconut drink. Coca still laying there? Yep, Coca still laying there. I gave her her medicine this morning, y'all. I give her a medicine at 10 o'clock in the morning, and I give her a medicine at 5 o'clock in the afternoon. She takes that pill twice a day. Keep eye out for Grandma, y'all. Y'all seen Grandma in there? I mean, she, uh... You know, naturally she don't want to go because she's got to get ready. You know, a woman can't just get up and get ready like a man can. But... Grandma needs a four-wheeler. Could you see her tearing the road up on a four-wheeler? 
in bell hey i seen the i seen the hummingbird houses you sent me hey that was real pretty uh i had never seen any but that was pretty i like y'all heard me say it before put your shoes on grandma the one with the screws in it <laughs> yeah <laughs> i seen my at a minute ago all right beardy granny thank you for tuning in and watching hey so, miss cindy miss lynn so you might want to tell them that this has turned into a road trip <laughs> for the new people coming in you decided I guess we decided on not doing the lights today. Where are we going? On a road trip. In the camper. In the camper. That's some of that's some of mystery man's spontaneous reaction. Well I know we need to do something and this right here is just too much for live something. It's just too much. Aw, uh, thank you, Ann picture of you and Bentley is precious. It's right there, y'all. Yeah, that's, I wish you had two of them and, and take one of them and wrap it up. Yeah, keep it. Mm-hmm. Give me five minutes and I'm out the door. That grandma? No, that's Cheryl Smith. Oh, <laughs> all right, come on, Cheryl. <laughs> Steven ain't got nobody holding him back no more. It's fine, Steven. I'll be waiting for the chest. Yes, it's off. It's in the mail. I'm in your circle. I'm in South Louisiana. Come to Florida. I have plenty of room. Wish I was born beautiful. I could be ready in a heartbeat. <laughs> you are beautiful. Everybody's beautiful. You know, I told them before that I didn't see beauty like a lot of people. I see the heart, boy. I see the heart. Don't be grumpy, Grandpa Robert De Niro, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I try not to be. I try not to be too She said she could see the pictures when you was little at Grandma's. Yeah. Where are we going in the RV? I'm gonna take a valium first. <laughs> Hey y'all, that, oh, that camper, I never drive it fast. And Tammy doesn't sound like some kind of a big man driving a camper like, but man, it's just as, it's, it's just as easy to drive as it is a car. Yeah. It's nothing to it. I, I mean, she thinks I'm somebody, you know. Oh, uh, thank you, Miss Green. Miss Jane said she was kidding about. Uh, calling you grumpy. <laughs> nah, I ain't. I ain't. Uh, I ain't grumpy. Road trip is good. I'm ready, come pick me up. I'm in Bristol, Tennessee, not that far. We can go down to Pigeon Forge and play. Hey, we can, we can be there in about 30 minutes, can't you, Steve? Yep. I'm kidding about the value. Hey, I knew you was. Like, we we on a natural high around here. Hey, uh, y'all, I, when Tammy's riding with me, I, I usually ride slow anyway, but when I was on the way up there to that, a uh, lake, you know, or Stephen, where we uh, stayed up there. <laughs> I was in a hurry and I had to slow down. Tim was freaking out on me. 
I'm in a hurry to get things done while rushing, rushing to life. I, I really, home. I really uh, probably think that Grandma Rugger uh, watch on TV then then go. I mean, she might would go if she had a notice. Fall coming, I love fall. But I can show y'all some stuff that Grandma, me and her don't think alike, y'all. I can show you some different stuff. You know what's funny? Look at the size wire coming out of this light. Yeah, uh, yeah. And then look at the size wire in the plugs. Well, somebody invented a better rat trap, didn't they? Yeah, uh, you know what? <laughs> I don't hardly get that. So let but, me... But I do know, like, it don't take very... You don't have to have heavy-duty wire for a little LED light like that. Thank you, Miss Ellen, for the super chat. She sent $50 for gas money. Hey, hey. She said, get on it. Hey, need to send about 300 for that camera. <laughs> hey, look here. This is the light. Look at the size wire that's on the light. And then the plug, the plug on the end, look at the different size that is. Now, there's an engineer somewhere out there that designed this. That, hey, you couldn't tell him nothing. Right, you know what? I couldn't tell you why <laughs> that. I couldn't tell you why that's like that. Oh, Ellen talking about you want 300, Danny? No, he was kidding. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, hey, y'all, when, when, when I take, when we go somewhere, it's around, it is now. Yeah. Probably around $300 to fill that camper up. And then I had to fill that Chevrolet truck up. And then I had to fill the boat up. So it's pretty expensive just to go right. somewhere. You'd be spent you'd be spent four or five hundred dollars and ain't even left town yet. Yeah, and and like uh, when Tammy goes to the grocery store, y'all, she ain't gonna run out of food. No. And snacks and and all that stuff. <laughs> yeah, we, we gotta have that. No, we don't need any gas money, y'all. We got it. No. No, no, don't don't send Heck a, a, no. If y'all want to help Steven out, that's fine. Uh, I don't, I myself am all right. We all right. Uh, Steven, I, I think we can go ahead soon. Uh, I, I don't think Grandma, I think, my ESP tells me she kind of rather just sit back and chill and watch on TV. fix it I can hear you now all right good deal hey daddy does kind of look like Robert De Niro you got got the beauty you got the beauty mark right here too Tennessee is beautiful in the fall you should come visit hey I like Tennessee I like the mountains I like the streams I like to see the elk Man, them big old deep valleys. I love that. I spent about $20 a day traveling to work. Oh, wow. If I'm in my gold truck, let me show y'all. If I'm in my gold truck right here, it's a four wheel drive. I have to fill that thing up every other day. It burns a tank of gas every other day. Now my diesel right there, that thing, that thing's about 140 bucks when I had to fill it up. But the good thing about it is I can drive it about two weeks. It, it's real good. You ready, Brother Hodges? Yeah, uh, let me tell you what to do here. All right. Oh. Uh, <laughs> take the camera and hand it to me. Take the camera and hand it to you. Right. Take the camera and hand it to me. Alright, check. Look at here. You want to see what you're recording or like? Uh, no, I'm going to give this back to you in a minute. Come on okay. here. Come on here, Steve. What we doing?
So, see that plug right here? Laying on the side? Unplug that. Mm. Okay, put it in the, this back compartment. I've took grandma riding in this camper for y'all, just to show her. Okay, shut that. Open the next compartment. And I don't know why, son. Just hold the starter button down. Here, do this right here. It's a long way to okay. the top if you want. Yeah, roll. that's better. Hold the starter button down. Tight. Yeah. Hey, we're good to go. Okay, y'all. Uh, go get you. Oh, battery pack over there. Huh? What would I do with that? Yeah, I don't know. But I still say you to me. So, for y'all that's just now joining in, oh, uh, the light doing video has turned into road trip. We moved this boat right here uh, because I couldn't see I got the top up. We was gonna work on that. I had to, we had to move it over here yesterday so I could let the top up. But y'all that putting in lights in is just too much work for a live video. It ain't too much, it ain't really too much work. It's just a lot of doing. Do I need my bill full in case I need a corn dog or you got some uh, money on you? You might better, I, I, call, I, I left my money I think. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, you might, you might want to, uh, you might want to get your money. Y'all, this ain't nothing to it. There's my GPS. But y'all, I'm so smart. I can go somewhere without the GPS. <laughs> I'm just joking about that. This right here is the most comfortable seat I've ever sat in. And I ain't just talking about car. I'm talking about I have had expensive recliners before. And this seat right here, man, you about go to sleep sitting there driving. And here comes Big Steve. Hey, we'll ride down there. Grandma, if you don't want to go, just don't come out. You don't have to come outside, but we'll ride down there. All right, Big Steve. Hold on, I got to go get something. Uh-oh. -uh. I got an invention. Hey, let me crank this joker up. I got an invention. What is that? That you ain't never seen. You gonna spring something new on me? Y'all know about this camper? It's got a, let's see, almost 48,000 miles on it. And that's now. Let's see what Steve's doing there. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ride down to Grandma's. I'm gonna ride down to Grandma's. I want her to go. Grandma, she's a breath of fresh air. I can understand why y'all love her. I did see that there, by the way. Yeah, thank you, Miss Ellen. Thank you for watching, BJ Manley. All y'all want here. I'm gonna show y'all some stuff today. I'm gonna wait for Miss Helen. All right, I'm gonna turn it back over to Big Steve. Well, <laughs> he's still messing around. Hey, y'all, Steven is somebody 
death prepared. Believe it, I mean, I know I ain't hell. Let me just put it like that. He'll have everything. He's got him some water. He's got him. <laughs> He's got him a banana. He's got him an apple. Man, what you talking about? He got Mark? his money. You gotta, Steven, be, you gotta be ready. Now, this time instead of showing you too much, I think kind of need to show where we're going something. You can shine it on you. But, All right. But uh, All right. here you go, y'all. Turn it over, Steve. <laughs> they said Grandma wanted to go, Steve. Oh, She's getting ready. We going to get her then, y'all. I bought this right here. This holds my phone. I bought that because I got a. I was talking to Grandma Helen on the phone, and I got a hands-free ticket. This was like about a month ago. Even though I had it. I, I was not holding it in my hand. I still got a ticket. But, oh well. You know what's beautiful about road trips? It's beautiful. Like the shoes done come off already. All right, don't hit my buggy there. You hit my, like. Yeah, uh, I got the truck cleared over here, Steve. Yeah, you good. Oh yeah. Hey y'all, this is like riding in a Cadillac, this camper here. It ain't no joke. No, what's what's nice is these vents right here. Down here at your leg blowing up both ends of your shorts. <laughs> That's like the ultimate. Now somebody was thinking outside the box when they come up with that. <laughs> watch how close we are to grandma's we we ain't taking a short horseshoe but we kind of are taking a horseshoe look at brother hodges over there then he done swimming up looking good <laughs> oh man like Steven? Yo. We got to see about that concert thing, you know. Concert? Oh yeah, singing? Yeah. Oh man, I'm ready. Hey, you know what? You know if I sang for four hours and 20 minutes, like when we just, all we was gonna do was go practice. All we was doing was going out to like, we was trying out new equipment. That was our first take at it. It was just gonna be straight up practice and we played four hours and 20 minutes so i can't imagine and we supposed to be showing on the way to grandma's yeah they they's looking at you hodge i baby this camper y'all i'm glad you know why why because when you get done babying it one day it'll be mine and you'll be babied it. And I always remember you babied it. <laughs> and I carry on the tradition. <laughs> so see, y'all, when you're driving this thing, I already, already know how I'm gonna back out of here. They said you look younger, Hodge. I got to go. Do I need to go pick her up? No, she no. She'll come when she gets ready. She might want a piggyback ride out here to the camper. <laughs> I know the people's tuning in. They're like, yeah, we're going to get to see lights being uh, hooked up on the boat. And then they like, we in the camper. And they like, what in the world's going on? <laughs> uh, if I was standing on the side of the road. 
road hitchhiking, I'd want y'all guys to pick me up. <laughs> hey, it would never be a dull moment, that's for sure. Man, what's going on with this? What you doing? What? Well, that's like when you need a break, ain't it? Hey, listen, when I'm camped by myself, I never shut them curtains. But, buddy, when Tammy gets in there, and when she goes to bed, yeah, she'll close both sides. Little, little, little Missy says, can I see her comments? I sure can. I sure can. Tammy's back there changing clothes. <laughs> she was all the way in the back. Yeah. I said, girl, we better watch out with them puppies. <laughs> yeah, the windows is open. <laughs> oh, yeah. I need to turn my chair around. Yeah, see, that chair what, that Stephen's sitting in will turn all the way around. It'll turn three seats. Oh, man, it'll lay back, too. You didn't tell me that. But, when you're doing a road trip, I myself don't think, I think people like want to see where you're going mostly. Hey, I know there's a lever in this thing. Instead of turning around smiling like you're in a toothpaste commercial. Not a toothpaste commercial. Hey, hold this a minute. Let me, let me just figure out what's, what's going on exactly. Oh, there it is. There might be buttons on the other side. Just right here. And uh, looks like you got, uh, got it reclined too much. Man, this thing's sophisticated. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, what's this on my pocket? Gotta have a snack for the road. <laughs> All right, I'm back, Hodge. Uh, let me get this thing right here set up. Good to go. Good to go. Hey, Steve, make, make sure that they did say Grandma was coming. Time for a German. Because oh, I never seen her actually say she was coming. Oh, you didn't? Uh-uh, but I heard some people saying it. Oh, this window's open. Hey, well, let me go see right quick. Oh, uh, just leave the camera here. Yeah, I'm going to leave the camera here. Dang it, I gotta put my shoes back on. The little girls have to get ready before they open the door, you know? Yeah, well, let me make sure she's even... It wasn't a misprint. Y'all, this camper right here going off is the reason I quit anyway. And... Oh, uh, boy, there's people sending me uh, messages. Want me to put them antennas back on eBay. And I just ain't with it. Man, the movie star is coming. Well, I seen somebody say she was coming. Lord, I run up there to the door. She said, I'm coming. I'm putting my shoes on. I still kept going. She <laughs> says, I'm coming. I said, I know. But I still want to give you some sugar and give you a hug. So I did. She's coming. Oh, Stephen, uh, yeah, I want you to let Grandma sit there. I will. And you get up. A kitchen chair and sit where I'll use 
like behind the camera. And if you turn it around on you and smile, they ain't got no problem doing that. But we'll do whatever you want to do, so. We're going to have three generations in this bad boy. <laughs> well, he might even not stop and get the mic. So, so a piece of sand behind the... Clean the windshield. Hey, uh, yeah. Hey, y'all, when I bought this camper... <laughs> I'll let Stephen do that. Yeah, I... When I bought this camper, y'all, it ain't been washed since I bought it. Hey, that's like stuff... That's, uh... That stuff don't come off with, like... Like you think. Take some take some commercial stuff to get that off. We'll try anyway. Steven and Danny, I can now watch you uh, singing on my big screen TV. The Hodges Comedy Show coming up. Y'all ever seen the movie Fast and Furious where the guy is always this Chinese looking guy or Asian guy, he's always on there. <laughs> he's always snacking, that's me. Y'all want a pretzel? I don't even know what that is. Try one? No. I know you wouldn't, but I was going to offer anyway. Hey, huh? When I eat when I get hungry, and I don't nibble all day long. Come on in! Hey, Yo, Cherry, the waits. Do you want a little windshield cleaner? Yeah, you bring a stool too? <laughs> they want to the carport. All right, well, come on. Y'all don't give nobody no time. Hey, we're doing good. There's your seat up there. I'm not sitting there. You might want to mute your phone. Oh, is it? Shoot. Hey, we're doing good. I need to turn it off, Donna. Well, you can let it play. I didn't even know it was on. <laughs> I just grab and stuff and... That's when you love it, Donna. Oh. Uh, Let's set up there. This table won't move so you can set that there. Look, go sit right here. Sit your coffee I don't, right here. I don't want to sit right here. You, you, I want you to sit here. Look here. You perfectly fine. Danny, make him sit. Will this sit down? Yeah. So he, do it then. That chair won't move. Oh, that chair won't move. I got a kitchen chair in there. Well, get me one of them and I'll sit right there. Let's go that leg, Steve. Precious cargo. On huh? board. Do you Let's need that leg. That windshield I brought, son. It's to wash your windshield if it needs it. Hey, we have stopped at the store. I, I didn't think about that. But you know them women's going to think about it. Well, I heard y'all talking about it. Look at that. Oh, but the chair won't move. Yeah. Bam, that's a low price. Well, just get a kitchen chair there, Steve. You know, hold I, my uh, snacks. Hold my oh, snacks, bro. Oh, I thought you meant... You can try one. I don't mind. Get a one. Grandma, did you see my video I made to this morning? I on, saw on something. Facebook? I saw something, and I... Let me sit now. I don't want to sit right here. Look, Grandma, you got me sit are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. This no. ain't this ain't my video. No, though. the way we say it is show. Are you, you show? You, you show it right here. Oh, look at this, Grandma. Yeah. You put your shoes on with the screw. Well, in it. I'm not going nowhere. <laughs> These is. Somebody said make sure you put your shoe on with the screw in it. Well, they comfortable. And I. They comfortable. I like comfortable. Y'all ready? Well, you ain't seeing your daddy. I don't want to see me, Grandma. Well, I'm fat, short, ugly, and stupid. Well, I'm 
<laughs> somebody want somebody one day want high to all of us. Somebody. Is this chair got a seat belt in it? Yeah. I see one. You want I, a you want a seat belt in it? No, I just I just saw it. Try this. Grandma, this I, camper I is loaded. What what Danny? This camper is loaded. Loaded with what? Everything. Precious cargo. <laughs> yeah. We got a rolling toilet. We got a rolling stove. Refrigerator. You ain't looking at the bed. Washer and dryer. Washer dryer. Yeah, Air conditioning. This is Danny's home. Whenever <laughs> he goes uh, goes away. <laughs> Some chili cheese fries. That sounds good. Everything sounds good to you, Steve. It does. Who's that there? Come on. That's that little boy. Got Dr. Woodard's uh, son is one in prison. Uh -huh. Grandma, when, when have you ever seen a Hodges worry about what they say? I don't guess that they do. Like, it ain't our fault like what he's done. Okay, well, you know, well, we ain't got to talk about it. So when y'all talk, kind of speak up cause of the noise. Oh. <laughs> and we on a dirt road. Life's good. Yeah, dirt, mud, and bumps. And... Y'all, they don't, they don't tell me nothing. But we got this drum on us this morning. You didn't want me to get the microphone? Uh, yeah, I, I, yeah. Make sure there ain't nobody behind you. But if well, that move, if hey, I would go jog and get it. If you don't want to pull out, I ain't gonna pull in there. Mm. Mm. So I'm gonna get to go jog anyhow. <laughs> well, that's in your nature, Stephen. Grandma, this is my third drink this morning. Oh, how do you hold that much stuff? Just being thirsty. Look at the house, and looks like we're selling here. I know it. Sounds like, I don't, I'm telling you, I don't know what people think. Oh, your camper's wop-sided, ain't it? What do you mean? It, it sleeps just, oh. it sleeps just fine. Hey, I don't know how he stands that. <laughs> Stuff don't bother him. I, I, I mean, tell me about it. Lord, is he, not, is he gonna go hungry today? He ain't gonna go hungry. Did they see all that stuff? Yeah, I showed it to him here. Probably while you was getting ready. Well, I had to hurry up and I ain't half ready. But I reckon I'll do that. I wasn't planning on this. And I knew you wasn't figuring I was gonna go. I didn't think you was going to go. <laughs> I know, yeah, I heard you. Oh, you was talking about that video this morning. I tried to do that this morning, and I think I done it, but I don't know where it went, and all kind of mess, and and you know what? What? My email ain't on my computer. Yes, it is. The one I had ain't. I ain't gonna get it up for you. You ain't gonna believe it. What? When I went to go get the microphone, I thought of something else I left. Them little twigs. Where am I going to snack? No. Is that why you use 110 pounds? Me and Mama don't. We don't, we not. We don't eat all alone. I don't. you a plum.
this thing shaking like a damn. I couldn't have figured that. underwater. Take this. Take this off. Little. Is that better? Is the sound better? Yeah, your guys are vibrating. Jay, you're going you gonna to have to hold it, Steve. Better. Much better. Miss Chun says, Hallelujah! <laughs> <laughs> that mic, there's not an improvement. This makes it where you can hear. That's the little grooves in the road to tell you you're running oh, off the road. Oh, that's what I hit that time you said I run off the road. He was running off the road. <laughs> yeah, we're getting her done now. We put we put some miles behind it. You know, I still got them wireless mics. You're vibrating. Hey, look here. Here's somebody having a fit to get around me. Are they, are they passing? They must think I can't afford a ticket. Yeah, they like. Yeah. Slow down, Eddie. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> he, he's still hot, Rod, ain't he? Yeah, did you see Robert De Niro's movie where he had that RV and boy, he was he got road rage wine within it, run people off the road. I want to know how your day is, Grandma. Wonderful. I've been out there uh, sitting with my chickens, uh, redoing little things and fixing that. You know them little things at the top was hanging down? Yep. I, I pulled all them out. Oh, okay. They was loose. You just had to pull them to get them loose. And I let them out, and they so sweet. They go right back in when I want them to. Oh. But I still watch Mr. Captain Hodges because little things set him off. And one thing is walk up on him and turn around and act like you're going to leave real fast. He don't like oh, that. Oh, you don't like that. What we do? Will, he will. Come on after you. What we're doing here, Brother Hodge? They got a window washer here. Well, we got one right here in the car. But I don't ride. He 
have to have a, a ladder to yep. get way up there, or brush or something. I'm in a Danny, you were telling me you, you, you had a rig right there at that cross road. Yeah. You know that man, the people that built my house, that's where, that's what happened to them. They, somebody pulled out in front of them right there and killed that woman. Mm. Where somebody pulled out in front of me was right here. At the red light. Where you I mean, talking about? Stop sign. Where you talking about is B.D. Perry. B.D. Perry? That's right. Well, you, you don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm going to tell you something. You don't know what you're talking about. Just a good old boy. I'm fit to go clean the window right now. They, they was coming out to the house to inspect my house. And a girl pulled out right down there where you said you had that wreck. And, and her car, the truck was in the ditch right here. Oh, it was? Know, yeah, I don't know what you talk about. Hey, you know what? They, they, they pulled out, they was, they come up to the stop sign real fast and then took off. And, uh, I, I hit them. And then they took their car and backed up to like they were stopped at the stop sign. Oh, and they told the law that I just went over there and hit them while they were sitting there. Oh, Lord. Well, that, we was out there waiting on them, and that's right where it happened, right where you had yours. It was a girl at that school who had been somewhere and come back, and she didn't stop at that stop sign. Kill that woman and that man that was with her, he was a banker. Hurt him real bad. I, oh, he's getting it. Uh, I almost got in a fight with the state patrol trying to tell him that she backed her car back up. Oh, uh, but they was at least 50 youngers tell them that they seen me just pull over there and hit them at the stop sign. Oh, gosh. But that thing ain't screeching very good. He looked at my skid marks and figured out that she did pull her car out in the lane, in my lane. It's getting pretty good, ain't it? Yeah. What's that street right there in the front? You know what that is? Oh. Uh, it's where the air conditioner leaks. Uh, is it on the inside or the no, outside? No, it's on the... It's on the outside. Well, it looks like it would, it, it would come off if it was on the outside. How long has that been... done? What? How long has it been since it's been white, washed off? It's been like that. Never. 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 <laughs> Never. And when I was talking to you on the phone last night, my phone went dead. I knew it must have. I kept hearing something. It was warning me the battery was dead. But uh, I thought it was something you was doing on your phone. You know, I bought one of them things there. Just to clean the windows and they never, I don't even know where it's at. Somebody on my Facebook that's watching Grandma and Stephen. They want to move from Minnesota to Dublin. They want to move here. And they've asked me about it. So we live out in the country. 
and 14 miles to Walmart. This county is about 30,000 people. You know those people moved from Minnesota that, that Shirley. Yeah. And si uh, Simon, yeah. Shaw, they lived in Minnesota. Yeah. St. Cloud, they lived in St. Cloud, Minnesota, where it snowed. He had uh, arthritis and stuff, and they said the climate down here would help his arthritis and stuff a lot. What? That woman said she she couldn't stand another Minnesota winter. Yeah, they the snow went up to the top of their house. I mean, I mean, they, they shovel snow and, and, that, and, I don't, I don't like a winter, uh, climate, a lot of winter climate either. <laughs> you don't, you ain't never lived nowhere. Well, I know I wouldn't. <coughs> I don't even like what we have here and it's mild compared to a lot of places. Yeah, and when I was in the roofing business. What's your windshield wipers on? You got any fluid in there? Let's see. I don't know how to cook the windshield wipers. You got to have fluid in there. Hey, gentlemen, it's good enough. Wait a minute. Let me give him this Windex. I brought some Windex. Man, y'all killing me. And there's women on there right now saying, y'all need to be in the shade to do that. Shade? Oh. He said we was killing him. Killing him? Yeah. Where am I? Oh, I'm sitting right. You know, I don't know what spot I was at, but there's a... You were talking about that woman wanting to move down here from Memphis? Yeah. I know one man that come from Michigan and then he... Turn your windshield and then he brung uh, everybody with him. I, they started moving down here, and I was roofing the houses for all of them. Windshield wipers ain't no good. <laughs> well, that helped a little bit. Anyway, what? They just started. Uh, he told everybody in Michigan about how it was down here, and they all started moving to Dublin. We have an awesome little town. I wouldn't move for nothing. Now they ain't they ain't much meanness here, y'all. You don't want to be in Atlanta, oh. and you don't want to be in Macon. That's right. They killing up there all the time. Grandma, he needs you to show him how to wash windows. Well, it's way down there, Danny. He can't reach it. And them, that thing he had ain't go good. And your windshield wipers needs changing. They got gaps in them or something. Right, Mr. Steven? I'm gonna see if I can make this turn, Grandma. <sighs> you have to think ahead when you're driving this thing. <sighs> I'm so sweaty now. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I don't even know if I would work. Yeah, so. It's cleaner. Good bit, you know. It's cleaner. Yeah. Yeah. But it's still. <laughs> Right here's where that car was sitting. Yeah. And I was coming from down, heading to the house. 
and that car pulled out and and I hit them and then they backed up like they were sitting at the stop sign. Like you run off the road and hit them. I hate that's what and that's what they were telling the staple drove. There's a school over there. Yeah, there's a the school little man goes to. That's the school Benny and you went to. I re that's right. I was the first class in that school when it was new. What? When they built that new, I was the first. It was my first year there when it was brand new. That school was there a long time before then. I was wondering why you didn't let Bentley ride the bus. Cause like, cause, I mean, I know I rode the bus, but I don't, I like taking it. It ain't no trouble to pick him up. You know what I mean? That bus is hot, like crowded. Yeah, I'll, I'd rather take it. Back to the school, Steve. That school was there when I was 17 years old. There was a school there. They tore that down. I don't remember no school being there before then. What you just seen right there was brand spanking new. Uh, well, when I was in ninth grade, it was new. It was built when I went to ninth grade. Yeah, there was another school, Grandma. No, I, I know, I, I got some pictures. I went out there, and the man that uh, installed the heating and stuff, done it right there. Yeah. I got a picture of me and my sister and that happened. When I ride in the car, I like to take my shoes off. Look, do you take your shoes off? Uh, you. No. If I go in the house, I take them off, but I don't take them off nowhere else. So you look in the manuals and give me. What about? They got the old school in there. Have you asked Grandma about horseshoes yet? Grandma, would you care about playing horseshoes? Grandma don't care about no horseshoe. <laughs> but who? I done something at my church one time. But I ain't. So if I got his horseshoes to play? Uh, I don't think I'd be all way. Man, Grandma ain't studying horseshoes. I like that other game, but I don't like the name of it, and I'm not going to say it. Duck, duck, goose? Yeah. <laughs> I'm lost now. Oh, I know what you're talking about. I think that's a terrible name to name anybody. Rummy? That's oh. right. That's right, Rummy. Yeah. Rummy. Like you, we used to play cards. Oh. Well, I'm lost, I reckon. Went over my head. I think that you have a little bean bag and you throw it. <laughs> You know why it's called that, don't you? Because it's... I don't care why they call it that. Because it's corn in the bag. Well, I know it's that, but... Somebody I, I, said maybe cornhole. Yeah, I, like... No, I don't like that piece of I mean, I like the game. <laughs> it's... Hey, it ain't... Whatever. You know, it ain't no big deal. No, it ain't. I'm pulling in the seat limit here. Pulling into the city limits. Show up the city limits. Coming in town. The actual city limits is at the school now. Do you know that, Mom? Uh, not really. They, they changed it. Every time they add on to the school, they extend the city limits out. Yeah, but the, city lim the school wasn't in the city limits 
wait for a long time. I know, it, it is now, they, they keep changing. They public water and all that, they have to That's put right. it in the city limits. I'm like rain man, Grandma, I'm an excellent driver. Are you? I like that big rain man. Like Don't show the bank. Don't show the bank. Talk uh, me out of it. I, I, uh, I like Raymond. That's right. And I like that TV series, Raymond. Series, Raymond. Never, Raymond, man. Never show a bank. Never show a bank. Why? Because I said so. Oh. I like to know the reason. Here's our one. Grandma, that's because you're a woman. It you want to know. And uh, us Hodges. If you don't know, and nobody don't tell you, you won't never know. That's where you can go buy you a four-wheeler right over there. Right after you pay full retail price. <laughs> <laughs> and also, in this town right here, we don't have bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic. Four <laughs> it's not bumper to bumper, Grandma. Well, it used to be when the Willow Mill was open. Homestead said, women want to know. That's how you learn. Women got to know. <laughs> a secret thing. A secret is a secret, but, you know, you can tell it. How you going to know if you just want to tell you. Yo, we got something in this town that... I don't know. Show them that station there where I get gas pumped. Free in my car. At, at Hooks? Yeah. Yeah. Right here at Hooks. That's the only place in Dublin you can get that. This is Grandma's full service station. She pulls up there and they pump you gas. They check your nice oil. Nice as they can be. They'll put air in your tire. Yes, they will. And they are very uh, polite. That's right. Well, that you stopped there, and I and I I went to school with the man that owned it. There's the grocery store, Grandma. I keep buying all your food at. Yeah, and there's our uh, post office right yep. over there. Yep, our post office is right there. We might have to stop by there. Hey, I checked yesterday. I asked you didn't have any package. Oh, well, I reckon I got everything I need. <laughs> well, I checked. Ain't my chickens pretty stinky? They are I pretty. They are pretty. Oh yeah. They so sweet. And we have about we have most of the eating franchise. Grandma, have you been in there? Ace Hardware? I have, and ain't it nice? Boy, they got everything you can think of yeah. in there. What was it, Hodges? We have uh we have most of the franchise eating places. Yeah. But you know in that town where we went up there to Clark's Hill? Yeah. Uh, let me show them this. Uh, they got a Hardee's there. Yeah. And, and we don't have a Hardee's. We used to have a Hardee's here, but it, it closed down. Can't believe you have a full service station. Oh, I'm yeah. showing where, Grandma. This is the road, Grandma, that I, I ain't got to tell you that. I let Grandma explain it. All right, Grandma, what's the deal? This is Elm Street. All these houses was here when I lived here. All this whole block was built up. They wasn't a place for another house. Uh, where we lived is on this side. Oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, I'm fit to get up here to it. Uh, you know what? I don't even remember which one it is. Well, I I can't see out too good. There's a window right there by you, Grandma. Let me stand up. Uh, which house is it? Let me see. <laughs> uh. Nightmare on Elm Street. Boy, that used to scare me when I was little. Oh. That. I mean, it, it may be further down. I, I don't think it is. Yeah, it's a little further down. That Freddy Krueger, like, I ain't like him when I was six years old.
Back then, life's done changed a lot, ain't it? That's hard to believe. That's hard to believe you, like, have trouble remembering which house it is. Well, they don't <coughs> change these houses. Oh, uh, what number is it? Can you see a number? I can't even remember what the number was. <laughs> it might have been that house right there. Or that one. I need to trim the bushes. You can't see nothing right there. I'm waiting on you to say, Grandma, that's it. Well, I'm trying to see it. No, nah, they've remodeled or something. I want you to... Oh, uh, she ain't forgot. They, they've they remodeled I, I or something. I want you to turn around and go back. Because okay. I think I can see out that other side better than I can see out this side. The lady that lived in this hen house... Well, the principal. She moved her house. See that house? Oh, she did? She, she moved it? Yeah, she moved it down there where George lives. She did? Yeah. That same woman? Rachel Branch? Yeah. Yeah. She moved her house. Oh, yeah. And it was that one on the corner. Did you see, Steve? Yeah, I can see. Hey, Grandma. Uh, tell them what year this was here. Uh, I was living here when you were born in 1960 and not too long before then. Then it's got a backup camera that's pretty nice. You can see what's happening. Where's it at? It's on the back. I mean, how you see it up here? Um, it's yeah. got a camera on the back. Right there is where Rachel lives. See yep. that driveway? Yeah. Remember the joiners? They lived. Yeah. Uh, right there or right there. And then I lived in the next house. I think it's that house right there. What's the number of it? Has anybody got a house number? They don't have house numbers. I don't reckon they get mail here. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. It's limbs rubbing oh. on the. Let me see. Let me see what that I'm is. I'm gonna be through the lawsuit on somebody. Miss, uh, who who lived there? Uh, Gays. The Gays lived right there. Hey, Grandma, I think it's been right there. there. I think the Gays lived there. We Grandma, that must have been our house there. That was no, it. You lived on the other side that way. What side? They lived on the left, you lived on the right. So it would be that one then. If the gays lived there, then this would be it. No, I lived that, that way from the gays. No, you did. I did, <laughs> Danny. You don't. I don't know where you're thinking. Comes hey, that's from. 117 if it helps. No, that ain't. Oh. Well, that ain't. Oh. The gays lived. Like facing my house on the right side of me and Miss Joyner lived on the left side. Well, I've got Gary or Neil on my face, but we'll right, find out. You ask. Cause y'all, <laughs> they used to fight. They used to fight over the fence. They, one of them boys would throw up something over that fence and they'd throw it back over there that fence. Oh, <laughs> they had a rough mama. Nobody. Hey, I'll show y'all where Tammy come from. Rags to riches. Rags to riches. <laughs> Let me back up here. You want the swap? Okay. Tammy, don't do nothing until I get moved. Okay. So I'm going to get knocked down. Are you ready now? I'm ready. Danny, Danny's thinking ain't ain't right. Uh, I, I, I bet you I'm going to be Daddy, right. Daddy, he was a little bitty boy. That's where you got run over right there. Yeah, I know. Well, and you was about three, four years old. I mean, your brother decided to go over there across the street 
And I said, do not leave this yard. And the, and, and the brother, you couldn't keep him nowhere. He Look at him holding back for me. Yep. Must be a truck driver. So we're going to leave at him. That's a yeah. one. That was a one man. Uh, so right there. Okay. Is where Tammy lived whenever I met her. That block house? Yep. Is that where you climbed this, in the window at? What is, yep. <laughs> what is the name of uh, this street? Oh, uh, I can't remember. But, uh, they done put a front porch. Oh, I don't think of it. They done put a front porch and stuff on it. Yeah, they remodeled and done uh, Cullen Street. So, O.D. Cullen lived right back there, and this street was named after him, I reckon, I don't know. So we actually right behind the hoops there now. Yeah. This, this was a, was a piano place that made pianos right yep, there. Yep, right there. And that building right back, right yonder. Right yonder. <laughs> right there. Was a upholstery place. They uphosted. That right furniture. there. Furniture. Yeah, that, that with that, uh. One, what's the name of it? It's probably still there. It does. It said East Dublin Upholstery. Yeah. Right there. It yeah. still says it. I should have known that. Cullen Street. It is on clear, Stephen, that way. Is you clear? You is clear. <laughs> the chair's kind of in the way. Yeah. Yeah, it does say Upholstery. East Dublin Upholstery and Mattress Company. Yep, that was there back then. Hey, they still open. Are they? Yeah. This is North End. So, uh, you remember who lived right there by that blue top house? Don't remember. I do. Who? The Brantleys. No. Yeah, they did. Uh -huh. We like disagreeing today. Well, Daddy, Daddy thinks he knows all this stuff. Well, Mama, well, Grandma and Daddy disagreeing today. The, <laughs> the Brantleys maybe moved in. Was it a Stuart? Well, who was it? I can't think of it. Oh. He just ain't he's saying it right. That, that green house is it right there. No, that ain't. green no, house it is ain't. it. We just did this far down. So is that how you met Mama? Y'all lived that close? No, man. What? Uh, that's whenever I was oh, like 15 mom. years old where I met Grandma. Oh. When I live here, was in the 60s. Oh, dang. Yeah, he the early 60s. He was born in 1960. <laughs> Since the race had behaved in him. Oh, man. Hey, Cynthia, they gonna get me riled up. Well, you you ain't... This here brain right here. What was that? That was the shoulder of the road. We just, just handled it. <laughs> There's Texas gal. She's in here. Look at this, y'all. Moving on up to the east side. Get myself a piece of the pie. <laughs> We're doing it, ain't we? Yeah. Oh, that's a people name in a minute, Danny. They had a little girl, and she was uh, had real curly hair, and she she lived down at the end of the street, and she's kind of a troublemaker that woman was. My house was white and had a black roof and she said, uh, every time I look up there and see your house, it looks like a black cloud up there. Not a black cloud. That's what she said. What does that mean? Does she feel better? Because <laughs> my roof was black, she said it made her look, look like there was a black cloud up there. Why? Why is it? Just kind of cut, you know, a little. Why bit. is it in older days like people like white roofs? They cool. White is cool. This, but, uh, are y'all telling them where we're going? No, Stephen's the one narrating here. No, we doing it to it, Grandma. We, oh, there's a lily pad pond. We spontaneous right this oh, moment. Oh, that's pretty. Lily pad pond. Yeah. 
this is where the home of the Redneck Games, known all around the world. Home of the Redneck Games. And uh, uh, what was he, the master of uh, ceremony? Elbow. Elbow goes to our church. Elbow goes to our church, and he was master of the ceremony. Redneck and this games. is where the redneck games take place. And they actually can, you can look that up. That's right. Redneck I mean, games, that's known worldwide. Bobbing for pig's feet. Yeah. In a tub and spitting watermelon. And in fact, we're going to have the same sort of thing at our church, but it's going to be for Jesus. There's, not, there's a stage yeah, they built there's a right stage. there. And when everybody would come and everybody would wear a bathing suit and they'd go get in the river. Uh, I'm gonna break! Danny, quit! Danny, I want you to quit. Uh-huh, he Daddy, just... Daddy, knock just, it off. Lord. He just threw something in the floor, didn't he? Yeah, hey. A bunch of stuff's in the floor. You should have put the Windex in the sink. It ain't the Windex. It's still set back there. Why don't, why don't you pull on show down him, there? Show him the Windex. Yeah, the Windex. Look down there what's in the floor. Yeah, he threw all that stuff off the table. Yeah, the Windex ain't what it was. Hey, every time I drive this, I throw something down. Yeah. Yeah, when you're doing what you were doing, starting and stopping it. Look at them old stumps over yonder across the pond. Yeah, they... I mean the river. <laughs> Are you? What you doing? Well, Stevens have pulled down here. Well, I think you need to stop. Yeah, we good now. We Yeah, don't go no further. I was thinking we was going to get in the water, but shoot, we ain't in no boat. Like if I had my spinner, I could just open up the window here. Yeah, they had bobbing for pig feet. They had the water uh, melon seed spitting contest. They yeah. had the... Look up Redneck Games in Georgia. They had the hubcap toss. The mud pit belly flop. Uh, and, uh, yeah, we're going to have that, that too. That guy that won the mud pit belly flop, wasn't he about 500 something pounds? I don't remember. Cody, I, Cody. I, I, I've never came. Cody got in that mud. I, I, got, I got some pictures of Cody in it. Like, let me tell you what, I came to the Redneck Games. Let me tell you what I've done. I walked from Granddaddy Marvin's house through these woods. And I toted a full-size couch <laughs> on over on my arm through the woods. It now it was a couch out of a out of a car, but it was a full bench seat out of a car. So I toted it. It was the one that went in your boat. Oh, right, here we go. You want to get out? Can you walk down there any closer or not? Uh, we got some room, some places to go, Grandma. Oh, okay. I didn't know what you This is the river, y'all. Y'all look up the Redneck Games in Georgia. I mean, they would come on, they'd spend the night, sleep out in the tents out here. They'd be vendors out here everywhere. Oh, and they, um, Rednecks from. I toted that seat through the woods. It was the one that used to be in your aluminum boat. It's still in it. No, it ain't. That old blue seat. It ain't neither. It ain't still in the but boat. But you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. I toted that through the woods and that's what I sat on. And like they was people talking about, now you know you're a redneck when you bring your own couch. <laughs> <laughs> and they'd have music right over there at that uh, thing. Yeah. Uh, and they would have vendors set up. Yeah, they Oh yeah. That's what we don't have it in our church. But it's not gonna be for. Yeah, it's doing the bathrooms there. Oh yeah. They got a bathroom set up here real nice. It real nice. I got it on sale at Target. <laughs> you can come fishing in these ponds. <sighs> What you think, Grandma, about a road trip? Uh, it's good. I like it. You know what the title of my video is? Yeah. <laughs> Can you change it? Installing Mr. Man's lights right on this boat. You had to pay to come into this. Yeah, so. they make you come. Wasn't it $5 a person? Did they? They charge? Yeah, they did. $5 a person. You walk from way up here. I mean, you walk. 
they parked way up at the end of that road. They had parked it, and on, they closed it on Saturday night, and on Sunday, they'd be still people laying out there in sleeping bags and sleeping in it. There's lily pad pond. There, there's where they... Yeah, that, that was motorcycles all yeah, out here. Yeah, was cars, and you had to walk them on. But they had a wagon that would come pick you up. Yeah, there. and this is where everybody parked right up here. They would uh, come pick you up and take you down there so you can't walk so far. But they'd be people walking too long all along there. Oh yeah. So this is about five miles from our house. Yep. Show that right there. Grandma said hurry, show that. <laughs> Buckeye Park, Boat Ramp, Picnic Areas, Fishing Ponds, Community House, City of Dublin. How about that? Yeah. This is East Dublin. It says East Dublin. Yeah, see the East Dublin. You just left that part Grandma, out. Grandma, you keeping it straight, ain't you? <laughs> Look at yonder. It, you see that gas station? What's the price of the gas? Not looking yonder. <laughs> 319 for regular. <laughs> Can they see it? I believe I could have beat the car to. here. Do that. 319. What's that 455 on the bottom? That would be diesel. Oh. Yeah, 455 for diesel, 319 for regular. I like how they got that shrubby trim. Right Stephen there. was born handsome. Well, thank you. I was born blonde headed, blue eyes, and I don't. This is what happened down the road. Mm -hmm. Danny, oh. Danny was born uh, <laughs> black headed. That man was looking at you like he like would just slap you any minute. You see him? <laughs> Every time I take this camper out, somebody says something about how good it looks. Oh man, it is. It's like a it's a chilling pad. Man, you can just drive all you want to drive. It's self-efficient. You just pull over, take you a nap. Yeah, you don't even need no electricity. Don't need no electricity. Got a got a generator runs off. That's a gas generator, ain't it? Yeah. Gas generator. Miles and we don't you don't need to drive with the generator. But we got the air conditioner on. Oh yeah. Yeah, man. Man, that's home of the banana split right there. Where? Right there. They got strawberry shortcake in there right now. Banana split? Oh, That's you know, they ain't got mind. no banana split in the grocery That's store. That's where I buy them, right there. I ain't lost my mind. Uh oh, Grandma, there's just some board side of the road. You better get out here oh. and pick them up. Well, they warped. They was one pretty good one. Since when has that ever mattered to you? Grandma, get it. Get that too. <laughs> They ain't very long. They're big old long boards, I would. Grandma. That's, what is she doing? That's a good That's a good board right there. That's a two by ten. Hit the jackpot. That is a good board, ain't it? Yeah, I had no clue it was a two by ten. Yeah, you should have seen that woman behind me laughing. <laughs> hey, ain't no shame in this game. So, y'all, I want you to notice the traffic. This is how you know everybody's rich. How? <laughs> this right here. Oh, us? Texas scale said, go around the block and get the rest of it. There ain't no more. We would have got it if we'd have seen it. I would have picked that board up too, Monique said. <laughs> 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 hey, there it is. When you when you uh when you buy wood all the time, there's a restaurant right down there. Yeah. They got a bunch of people there too. So there's a building in deep front. That, uh, I put that roof on right there, y'all. 
on that auto parts store. So see y'all, it's just like I said. You don't have to worry about traffic. Show them Danny's antennas over here, Steve. Oh, yeah, there. there's one Daddy's antennas on that building right there. Antennas. <laughs> Grandma, I love how we talk. We don't much. Do we, do we talk funny? Hey, everybody says we talk funny, but I think everybody else we talks funny. We hillbillies, Grandma. Well, that's all right. I don't, I don't feel like I talk funny. I feel like everybody else talks funny. And the thing about me is I I don't say they talk funny. I like when I hear a different accent to me, I want to do it. So this, I, this is the way to go where I used to work. So I practice like talking like other people. You do? I can't talk like nobody else. Grandma. What? Yeah, yeah. We're going to go down there and get a banana split down there. They give us one that was you know, running out the <laughs> I mean, couldn't get the lid off it, so... You don't do voices? Can Who? you do an impression? Who, me? Yeah, do an impression. No! I can't do nothing. You know the hop in over here we got? The hop in that stays up across from the Chevrolet place? What hop in? At the gas station. When you right go up... Right the Dairy Queen there, Grandma. Oh, oh, yeah. Hillbillies. Okay. Hillbillies wouldn't have internet, I don't think. <laughs> well, oh, that right there, is that the Senior Citizen Club? Yep, Lawrence County Senior Club. Yeah. When you go in that hop in, you know, they... they. What's that right there? Ducks in yep. What's that mean? That's a contract company. So, that ain't duck, that's duck with a T. Oh, oh. Like duck work. <laughs> that's right. Oh, oh. Golf course right over here. I played we golf. played a lot, didn't we, Grandma? Yeah, right over there. Well, this used to be J.P. Stevens. Yeah. Before they changed it to. Uh, so this big fence-in spot was the Woolen Mill. Yep, it was. How long did you work Force, there, Forceman? How long did you work there? Thirty-five years. Thirty-five years. Can you? Did you ever would think they'd level it? No, no, no. I didn't. There's where you go in a long time ago, but they moved it. Yeah. Uh, to, on down that further. And Grandma, almost everybody here starts out working at the oil mill in this town. Yeah. It they was, it was a they good did. Job. It was inside. It wasn't hard. It was, well, it was a job. They and did. Made, they made yarn to make wool clothes and stuff. They the Dublin part, there was a Nathaniel part, that's the part I worked in. Dublin part made wool, and we made uh, worsted stuff. <laughs> we have we have deputy sheriffs that used to work at the wool mill, didn't George? Yeah. The mayor used to work there. Yeah. Sure yeah. He's a tax man. And that's right. Almost everybody worked at that wool mill when they was young. Daddy worked there. He figured out ways to like get out of work. He <laughs> Granddaddy Marvin had worked there too. Daddy figured out how to like. He figured out little tricks to make it easier on him. He said when he go clean out one of them machines, he wouldn't clean out one or all of them. He'd just do some of them and uh. He said, you just taking the chance whether they're going to look or not. <laughs> Be right back. Someone's at the door. Yeah, Grandma, that hop in over there, when you go in there, they like, welcome to the hop in. Oh, they do. <laughs> yeah, he's like, he's like, would you like to buy Slurpee? And oh, then like, do. yeah, he says that when you walk in and then when you go to pay, he's like, would you like to buy a lottery ticket today? <laughs> so I'm like, hey, like I can't help it. I get, I like, I come smiling. No wonder he's trying to sell me something. Cause I'm like, I'm off my wheels and my head's turning. I'm like wanting to talk like him to him and let's have a conversation. And uh, but I had to watch it. 
you know. Oh, you, you don't talk back to him like he's talking to you. I have before. But I just, <laughs> sometimes it comes out and I like gotta catch myself. Steven, tell him where we at. We on Pinecone Street. Okay. Now I remember living here. Where? I remember Daddy's keys come out of his ignition right here and he burnt two holes in the pavement down to the clay in the road. Remember your keys come out and the throttle got hung? Yeah, I mashed, I took off real fast and the keys slung out of the ignition. Man. And I had to hold a brake down. So this is the house right here that we lived in. I can tell you that. This is the house we lived in when I was little. This fence right here, you see, this is where the lady lived I would climb the fence right here, y'all, and I'd go over there and tell her I was hungry. And she'd pitch me breakfast. I remember that they said they got up one morning, you had Christina in the high chair feeding her. Yeah. <laughs> and she was a little bitty thing. Yeah, we like to eat now. And you was feeding her. You wasn't too big yourself. These houses here hadn't changed them, no, Grandma. And, and they no. ain't no, no but body build in between because they ain't no room. Yep, that's right. They, they've been there like that Elm Street back there. It's been there so long. And all them houses was uh, built right next door to each other. There ain't no room for no, nobody else. I'm fitting to show you something, Grandma. You, you ain't going to hardly believe it. And I've thought about it a thousand times. And... and you take, you're taking a left or a right here? I'm going to take a right. Okay, because I want to I want to show them that ball field, too. Okay, we'll do that. I got something to add to that. I'm going to show Grandma what I was doing one time. I made a cart. Hold on a second. Look at this. This is what's beautiful, living here. They got their mailbox out there side of the road. Somebody's dog, or trash can, somebody's dog didn't come oh. up there and strode their trash. Welcome to East Dublin. There's a bunch of towns no, out there. there. <laughs> Man, East Dublin's a good town. That is, no, that's, that's a, very unusual right there. That's a, that's just a joke. We Hey, we're good people. A lot of good people here. But, you know. So, see this hill, Grandma? Yeah. What about this hill? I, I built a cart. I was riding that cart down this hill Dang. with no brakes no brakes stick my feet out to stop Dang. and this is also grandma tell them what road this is elm street mary drive and tell them what it what about mary drive that's where we live down there on the other end before you moved this is the last place you lived before you moved out yonder yeah. And they was snow, and they they had an old piece of something. Uh, they was that, that's a drop off right down there on the left. And they go down that hill, sliding with on that snow. Yeah. They they had a a, a hood of a car. Yeah, it was something I didn't know. What Dang, was pulling it through the snow with a jeep. They were doing all because we didn't get much snow back then. Back then, you know, and they was and doing all kinds of stuff with, with snow. So, Grandma, this is when you started getting rich. Started getting rich? Yeah. I did? Yeah. How do you get rich working at the wool mill? And you was rich compared to what you come from. Grandma come from no electricity and no running water. No electricity and no running water. No car. And when you ate a when you ate an orange, you ate peeling too. When they walked to school, <laughs> they walked ten miles through a blizzard, <laughs> toting a hundred pound bag of seeds, cotton seeds. Hush, Danny. Them people don't believe you. Hey, All right, here you go. This is it. Yeah. Which one? The red roof there. The red roof with the fence around it. They didn't have no fence, and that tree right there is the one that they was building a fort in, and the hammer fell out. That's a cute little house sitting there on that trailer. Yeah. Or whatever that is. Yeah, that's what we did right here. I could build one of them, couldn't Swing I? Swing around here and show them good, Steve. 
Yep, this is the house Grandma lived in before she moved to where she's at now. Jacksons live right there next door. Oh man, somebody just put some money and put some cross ties out of Not cross ties. So Steve wants to ride by the ball field. Danny played ball, baseball. Yeah. All he had to do was walk across the backyard. So see these three houses right here? There's three right here and there's one on the corner. Turn in here, Hodge. In the road? No, turn in on this street. Sunday line. I thought you wanted me to turn through the yard. No, man. This is the this is the baseball field I played on and I'd knock balls over this fence into these yards. Like I could I could just toss the ball up. And he was little too. I could toss the ball up and hit it and knock it over this fence. He was he was not a big uh, I mean he, he was young. No, I could get I had to like the most in the park home runs. And you remember who lived here? Huh? Right behind us here. Yeah. You know that Foskies. Yeah, do you know Jeff is on Facebook? Uh -uh. Yeah. Lives in one of the Dang. But you remember, I was watching the news yesterday and I seen them showing a baseball player that had an in the park home run. Like a major league guy. And man, they was making a big deal about it. Cause that's about unheard of. But you know, when we played ball on this field too, I would knock it in that water tower fence. When we played ball, I would have like 23 in the park home runs for the season. Hey, Ellen, the property's cheap, huh? Yeah, uh, y'all don't pay Stephen no attention. He's I, don't, I don't know how, how cheap it is. He's tubbing is a nice cheaper. place. Yeah, it's definitely nice. Always. It just ain't, uh, it ain't a moony neighborhood. That's a, yeah. That's Poplar Street right there. That's your buddy that lives right there. Who? Daddy. Who's that? That's that one when we was, uh, we was on vacation that time. She was out there skinny dipping in the pool. You remember her now? You hit, you took the clothes and hit them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Small world, ain't it? Yep. Daddy didn't remember the part about the skinny dipping, only that he took the clothes and ran off. <laughs> hey, I was there. They tried to get me to go out there and I told them I was good. Yeah, it is. Daddy, which house is it through here that like the man got killed with the pitch for? Like his daddy killed him. It ain't here. It ain't in this. It's out on, uh, uh. Didn't I used to go to the nursery right here? Yep. This block building? Yep. I remember that. That's where you spit on his face. Did I spit in her face? Yeah. Man, she done something I didn't like then. <laughs> Cause that ain't, that's out of character for me. Look at that rock house, that's pretty. That show sure is. I wonder where they got all them rocks. Ain't no telling. Still got some coffee left? Daddy's got a sip. You finish your coffee? No. Gotcha. I sip on mine all, all day. I don't drink a pile of it. What's, what's that right there? That is main essentials. Never somebody, heard of it. Somebody, on, somebody on, on YouTube said, 
That's something about down that, the old Ever Road. That's a beauty uh, shop. That place right there. What is that? I don't know. I didn't. Uh, somebody's people has that. Uh, I saw it on the, one of the comments. You know what's funny about this right here, Daddy? What, Daddy? This building right here, they spent $10 million renovating it to open it up to sell lumber. Now, this is my thing. If you had $10 million to get a business operational, why would you want to get a business running? Why don't you just keep the $10 million? Tell me now, about now. it. Like, used to be. What did it used to be? Had all kinds of stuff they sold. Hey, yeah, it was Choo Choo's Fly. Yeah. It was Charlie's. Oh, that's yeah, right. That's right. It's good to see y'all along the road trip, y'all. We in our little town right here. Stephen, if you can show them the Falcon on the side of the water tower. There it is, right there. That's what our football team is, is the East Lawrence Falcons. Yep. What's up? Yeah, okay. I got you. Got it. I didn't know that. There it is. Boy, I wouldn't move nowhere. You know, the man that run this right here, you know, he's in the nursing home now. Is it? I'd rather not say. Hey, he was about crazy. Anybody that dealt with him got skin up. Well, I know another. Like, he's one of them that... He's one of them that if he could beat you out of a dollar, you, you can well, count on it. I know another. Do you? I bought a truck from him. <laughs> you did. Lost my money. Lost the truck. Out. Grandma, that didn't never get resolved. No. He didn't have to give you your money back. No. They told him he had to do it, but he paid it one time and quit. And every time I went up there to get it checked on. Look, that man's selling sweet potatoes. They, they said I had to get a lot. Well, that's wrong. Uh, that man. stuff right there is a rip off and a half. The judge said he had to pay, or they would pick him up and lock him up. Was nothing but just blowing smoke in the air. Hey, J uh, Johnny, jumping in on our lunch break. Good to see y'all. Hey. Somebody says Stephen and Renee's both single, ready to mingle. Hey, congratulations. Tell him what he's won, Johnny. It's a new car. <laughs> it's a new freedom. Yep, a new freedom. A new trip. Get her done. Go, Where are we going? The roaches just drive around. That's a, uh, <coughs> hey, you can't hardly get a regular truck in there. Oh, you can't? No, I can't even hardly get my truck in there. Oh. Michelle Bailey said, you got new chickens, Grandma. I do! Woo! They're so cute. Did you see one of them almost jumped out of the basket? Yeah, he jumped up there on the basket. I didn't know what. I mean, them little things can, oh, oh, coat, Steve. There's a bunch of pallets over there. I need some. Do you? Steven, you might want to tell all the new people why we have got a road trip instead of the light video. Well, for the record-breaking people that's in here on this video, <laughs> I, I titled my video like Installing Lights on Mr. Man's Boat. Hey, and that was the plan. But uh, Daddy ain't like me, you know. Daddy got out there and we got rolling. He got to thinking about it. And he was like, yeah, we might better not do this. This is a lot of work. 
So, so he's like, so he's like, let's go on a road trip. I think we're going to go on the road trip. Hey, Stephen, you tell me a record breaking. I mean, people got 410. Dang. What the? Yeah, you, you thought I was being sarcastic. Well, I didn't know what you, I didn't know if you did change. Nah, man, I wouldn't be sarcastic. Can you see the river? <laughs> the river bridge? They can now. This is the bridge that separates East Dublin and Dublin. Look yeah. at this. Can you change the time? Roll that beautiful bean footage. You can change the title, but it's not a good idea. Look at this guy on that bay. Got him a bay. This is roaches right here. Grandma, this is the stove she likes. Oh, Daddy, you going in here? Grandma, I, I, I'm like... Oh. Uh, Stephen just said you can't hardly get in here. Yeah, I know what he said. Oh. I'm like Rain Man. I'm an excellent yeah, driver. You, you like Look, you. Grandma, there's some more pallets. Just come load them up. What? Some pallets right here in the back. Where? Just come oh. load them up. Shoot. <laughs> That's some wood, Steve. Well, we done got some wood when we come to town. I'm an One. excellent driver, Grandma. One board. Yeah, this right here. Yeah, Grandma, I'm an excellent driver, Grandma. One board. His daughter runs it now. Look at all this cement stuff out here. I know it. Look at all the... Uh, they got flowers. They got, look at the bulldogs up yonder. Oh, look at the elephant in the bird bath over there. I don't see it. Yeah, don't get out. Don't get out. Don't get out. We got somewhere to go. Well, I'm just yep, standing there's some, up. There's some, <laughs> there's some Georgia bulldogs. Hey, Grandma, you and Stephen and I will get out this thing and be like bird dog getting off the back. Oh, look the at them owls right there, Grandma. There's two owls oh, yeah. right there. They ain't pretty as one I got, but they heavier. There's some there. cowboy boots. I see some butterfly bushes. Butterfly bushes? Right down here side of this. I gotta get up. Right. I can't take it sitting down. Right there. Right there. Where at? Right there. Oh, that is butterfly bushes, ain't it? Oh, there's cannon lilies right there. They are canna. Canna lilies. <laughs> hey, they canna. I'm learning something every day. <laughs> hey. I'm You've there. been calling them that the whole time. <laughs> hey, it ain't bothered me one drop, apparently. Well, they probably knew what you was talking about. That looked like a pineapple on that one. Look Ooh, at the, look there's at them, a big angel look at, over there. Look at them boots yonder. I seen them. Look at them frogs doing piggyback on that This mountain. woman. <laughs> I got to move on, y'all. Somebody's behind me. Let's get her done. Uh, this this woman that owns this, I mean, runs this place now, her daddy, is I went to school with. If you think we scared, you backing up. She, uh, she gave me a, a lily. Just because she wanted to because I Was it a cannon lily? No, it wasn't no cannon lily. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Man, we can build all kind of stuff for them paddles. Go ahead, Grandma. She, she, uh, they know me in there. I went in there the other day and that woman said, hey, hey, Miss Helen. I said, how do you know me? She said, I watch your videos Look, all Grandma, the time. There's just oh, some, good gracious. There's Look at them fences. Some chicken oh. pens right here. You know people are really, really getting chickens now. Look at that. Look at that small grate wire right there. I'm getting me some chickens. I'm thinking about getting me some chicken too. Look at that. Look at that hog panel down there. 34 feet by 16. That's what I'm talking about. See, when it gets good to you, you have to. <laughs> it ever get good to you, Grandma? Yeah. <laughs> like, when you, like when you was eating that banana split the other day. Yeah. Grandma, you got your bill full with you? No. We might need to stop and get about five or ten dollars worth of gas. I was thinking about getting me a uh, Sunday. You know what? You can't drive this thing through there. Sure we can. You know what would be good too? What? A double cheeseburger. Oh, I don't want a double cheeseburger. I 
Grandma don't. She wants the ice cream. I she ain't stood. A pineapple sun. All right, let's get Grandma one because she'll hold her breath until she passes out. Will she? Yes, sir. <laughs> well, thank y'all for getting me one. Yeah, we can get you one. I'd buy you one just to show us like we riding Steven. around. Stephen's got the Dairy Queen. Uh, hey, I don't live like I'm rich. I just spend it like. Uh, you spend it like you rich. Like, a, like if I'm down to my last twenty dollars, I don't even worry about you it. You make just, it look good, don't you, Stu? It, we look good doing it. That truck looks like the one I spent that much money on it. It, it, it does. Didn't get nothing for. But that man will pay someday. He will not. Profit. Hey, if you want to set him, I run in there. I, hey, I'm pulling there. Oh, pulling in there then. I'm an excellent driver. Pull it up in there. It, it don't hurt to brag on yourself, does it? No. Pull it on up in there. Let's get some ice cream. Don't, don't talk like that, because I won't get, I must be spilling out everywhere. Now, I don't think I can go to the window. Oh, that's, that's what you're talking about? No, just pull over here to the side, and I'll go grab some ice cream. You want one, Hodge? Uh, you want a, hey. you want a vanilla milkshake? Uh, no, I don't want nothing. You want to order an onion ring? I don't want nothing. Uh, uh, chili dog? <laughs> hey, uh, let me ask Grandma something. All right. What, what used to, what that building right here used to be, Grandma? It used to be a, a little car dealership. I got to find my shoes. Chevrolet, yeah. Chevrolet, wasn't it? No. Oh. Old I Mercy Baby It was a car dealership, but what kind was it? I don't know. <laughs> it's even with food. You like knocking down. I dude. thought he was gone. He's picking hey. up all that trash you snatched off the dash wall. That was a Ford dealership there, Grandma. Where's where's the cab? I lost oh. it's right here. Oh, all right, I'm going. I'm going to get us an ice cream, pineapple Sunday. Yeah. Not a banana split. Ah, uh, no, I can't eat no banana split. That too big. Right. They too big. Just because I can run home, don't be leaving me now. <laughs> if you had somewhere to park and not be here when he comes out, he'd probably have a fit with me. I'm gonna do like you always do me, Grandma. Right time I get to the car, I'm gonna take off. I do and then stop and start laughing. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do to him. I bet Steven's gonna keep that board right, John. Hey, y'all, when I was, I showed it to you. You might not see it too good, but I'll try. See that camper sitting over there? I went and looked at that camper whenever I bought this one. Well, is it better than this one or not? Hey, it, ain't no way it can be better than this oh. one. Ain't no way. This thing is loaded, Grandma. This what? No, cheap model. Or this ain't a cheap model. Well, it's nice, I mean, to be sitting in here and just... You know, the thing about the camper business, y'all, or like having a camper, is you around, you around millionaires and stuff. Yeah. 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 I'm trying to, I can't see that right. I'm going to try to see it, but... Y'all, I never dreamed we'd be in this thing riding around getting a uh, pineapple Sunday of the Dairy Queen today. Grandma, you got to say this is stop riding in style here. Ain't it? Yes, it is. I can ask Tammy about going camping. She don't even know if she even wants to go. Huh? She don't even know it's so spoiled. She don't even know if she even wants to go. Oh, that's spoiled. 
Yeah, she spoiled. She just rolled with the flow, don't she? Yeah. Y'all, it's a beautiful day, sunshiny day, and I don't believe it's going to rain today. Hey, y'all, I was telling y'all that, uh, like the people in Dublin and East Dublin, I don't even, I ain't never seen Stephen put nothing on Facebook about he was broke up, and, and I don't even think people in this town know it. He's never put nothing, he's never put nothing on Facebook about it. I was telling him about it the other day. Everybody thinks Stephen's got a bunch of girlfriends and he, 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 he don't. I don't think he's ever. I mean, he's, he's just free. Uh, a lot freer than he realized hey, grandma, he was. Uh, I don't know if he's so sure, but so ready to jump back into the frying pan. <laughs> big step and it's a it's a very uh poor odds against you because he's already done found that out already a bunch of times and grandma him just being here with me and you tells you a lot you know yeah i mean he could be out with his with the boys and men all doing all kind of stuff he is hanging around his mama his daddy his grandma and his youngins. Yeah. I that's mean, that's what I'm talking about. That tells you a lot right there. I mean, he's he's not all hunting uh, uh, hunting nobody. He's he's hanging around with the who who what grandson, forty years old, hangs around and laughs and has fun with their grandmother. Yeah. Daddy used to like me to go to the mountains. I never went. But, uh, I didn't want to go ride up there with no old folks to the mountains <laughs> and ride 40 miles an hour. <laughs> but, and, and that's what I'm talking about. Stephen would do it. Yeah. And he, he's happy most anything he's doing. He makes it fun and he's is enjoying every minute that he spends, you know. He, He's not grumpy, he's not grouchy, he's willing, he's, he's ready for anything you want to stop and get a Dairy Queen with a big old camper in the parking lot and he gets out and goes and gets it, brings it back just as happy as he could be. That's another thing, if, if you, any, anything you want to do, he's ready. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't, uh, don't know where he got all that. I don't either. I don't think. You know, and he's never hung around with a bunch of boys and riding, uh, you know, wild acting. You know, he spin wheels and all that mess, but far as being wild and, uh, You know what, Grandma? I actually was going to tell him about this one day, but Stephen, he always been a real neat dresser when he went to school. He would dress in nice clothes. Uh, he didn't, he, he uh, always wore nice clothes and, and he don't like his hands dirty. <laughs> if you watch him, he don't, he don't like to get dirty. We gonna get out of here, Danny. Santa Claus is in. Grandma, I'm an excellent driver. Well, that right there's a little tiny driveway. What what I miss? Have y'all got out the boxing gloves yet? No. Grandma. We breaking you over the coals. Grandma, I told them it was your birthday. They gave ah! you they gave you extra pineapple. Look I, at there. Rain ain't gonna be able to open it up. I know. I said 
I said, bless grandma's heart, she ain't gonna be able to take the lid off of that. <laughs> I think the Dairy Queen ought to put go on the payroll. You think so? <laughs> I got me. What'd you get? I got me a hot fudge Sunday. You know what? I really don't know if I'm gonna be able to get out of here. You may have to wait till the traffic. When's it coming? May have to wait on the. I'm yeah. talking about I ain't joking. <laughs> well, oh, watch your side over here, over here. You know what I got, Grandma? What? I gotta guess. watch what your daddy's doing. If, I, if I'm gonna be in a wreck, I wanna be looking. <laughs> That's what I got. Oh! You like onion rings? You want yeah. one? Uh, you fit to get pineapple everywhere, ain't you? I can't get the lid off. <laughs> Steven, look down the street here and make sure I'm clear. I don't know where to turn it upside down. She got it all the way. The whole... If I turn it upside down, is there more room? You know what she did? She filled that cup about half full of pineapple, and I watched her. She had it in the lid, turned it upside down, stuck it on it, and rolled it over. And she was like, "Ta-da!" Oh God! Where That's, was you at? I was watching. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it down here because I think there's more room down here. She was grinning the whole time. She probably remembers your big <laughs> She was grinning. I uh. -oh. I didn't forget what I was going to say. I just uh, need some help. I think I'm going to get it. I reckon I might need a seatbelt on with the daddy. You're missing out on these onion rings. Well, shoot! What did I do wrong? Nick? Well, I couldn't get it on. And my pineapple's all on the box. <laughs> what, you turned it upside down? Looks good to me. I couldn't open the lid. Uh, it was too big. You I don't never eat them strawberry sundaes no more, Grandma? I really have pineapple. The strawberry we, we got last time oh, it was. was tart real bad. It, it was. <laughs> it was what? Real tarty. Tart. Like sour. <laughs> not sour, uh, but not sweet. It was rough enough me and all her ate the rest of them. Here's your buddy there picking somebody up. Yep. Y'all want some? I've got a banana spit because I can't hold it. Y'all have an onion ring. I don't think y'all ought to be trying to make everybody hungry. <laughs> <laughs> no, I ain't trying to make everybody hungry. I'm just showing them what I mean. That's that girl there that went to school with Christina. Remember? Oh, uh, I can't remember. Ooh. Hold on now. I need on. I mean, we're gonna feel like we hogtied in the camper. Do you see that pizza place right there? Yeah. And I, I, think, I think I need some brake fluid. Great. Grandma, I'll take you to that pizza place you wanna go. Look at that yellow Corvette. How can you fix all my pizza and you sitting here eating onion rings and... What are you eating? Did you get ice cream? I did, it's milk. Oh. Oh, oh I, I thought you just got onion rings. You got uh, ice cream and onion rings and bananas and... All kinds of stuff up here. He won't go hungry. Grandma, I only eat one time a day, and I'm doing it right now. So, Stephen, I was wanting to one day go to Bass Pro in the, uh, in here. Where you at? Hmm? You waiting on permission or what? Where are we going? I've asked you about it before. Well, don't go today. <laughs> Look at that bull out front there, Grandma. Ooh. 
What kind of place is that? That's a Mexican store. What was that? What is that tin stuff up there? That's a visor to put over the window to keep well, the sun out. What is that bell down in the floor? That's men with Pokemon cards. That's a, when you drive this camper, there's always something falling. Sure you don't want an onion ring? I'm trying to give you an onion ring. So y'all see that they, it's like I said, there ain't not much traffic. Grandma, that's where I buy your goldfish, right there. Oh, but that's been there a long time. last onion ring. Is that gas right there the same as that we just come from? No, that's three fifty nine and four eighty nine. Was that other cheaper? I think the other was three nineteen, wasn't it? Yeah, they higher. I don't ever worry about that's the excellent. I don't worry about how much it costs. I just go to that place they pump it. You don't even look, do you? That's the way I was wearing. That's what, that's the way you rich folks do. <laughs> they don't look at the price. <laughs> I was on the other side of town. I said, oh, I need some gas. And I said, I look at old cotton like it. I seen somebody. I seen somebody post on Facebook the other day. They wish they could just pump gas and look off and be in a daze instead of worrying about how much it's going to cost. <laughs> Ain't that What's in this creek, y'all? Right here. Turkey Creek. Uh-uh. Oh. Uh -uh. Urban Heart Ship. Hunger and hardship is right. Oh, I didn't even know that. Man. How are you? Oh, good. It's hot fudge. It's winning. About pineapple way down here with the pot. I'm going to have to dig it out. <laughs> Man, he just run the doors off of that. You see that? Shoot. He ran that stop by like a champ. What is it? I'm trying to hold on. Can't take off. He don't ease. <laughs> yeah. So then I'll tell him where we go. William on. And and who who used to live here? My daddy. Say it a little loud. My daddy, John D. Hall. <coughs> Y'all can call up William until William was coming. No, Hodges don't tell nobody nothing. Yeah. You got if, that right. If William was a woman. I would call him. We like to just spring it on you where you ain't got no... Uh, yeah, I know. Uh, Y'all done that to me this morning. You don't know how somebody truly feels just spring it on them. <laughs> Believe it, Grandma, what I'm doing. 
Oh, that's a Sunday? I mean, yeah, that's a Sunday. I didn't eat it all. I know you could. I had to get me a double, ah! cheese, double cheeseburger. You can't go without getting a double cheeseburger. No, it do Yes, double cheese with pickles, tomatoes. And then that shake ketchup. Yeah, I'm gonna hold it. I love onion rings. I made a new ring lover. And y'all, we do have some sections in Dublin. That's like for rich folks. They, they out in the country. Yeah. Well, that ain't the rich section no more, Grandma. But it did kind of used to be. Yep, Holly Hills. We've done a bunch of roofs in there. I'll tell you what. If, uh oh, I can't stop. Little bit here. What are you doing, Grandma? I was trying to get it where I could put my foot on it, maybe put the shakes up, but I can't get it. This thing don't stop like a car, y'all. Well, shoot, where are you going? Well, I just gonna show them uh, a few of these houses here. Uh, this, it ain't high class, but it did used to be. I look pretty to me. Yeah, but it ain't high class, though. But we got all kind, y'all. But over in East of them, the houses are a little nicer in Dublin. Yeah. Let me see. Where we go? Can they see it? Stephen and need to raise it up. I can see it. Can they? They can see it. Well, I kind of wanted you to show some of the houses. On it. <laughs> I didn't necessarily want to show them the street. Well, I can't see no house. Yeah, but like I mean. Ah. <laughs> I promise you I'm done. I've been eating for an hour and 59 minutes. Look at them banana trees, Grandma. Mm -hmm. And elephant ears. Well, they so growing, ain't they? Sure will. wonder what kind of fertilizer they use. Look at their windows. They got their windows blacked out. Or tinted. Oh, is that a new house or is it? That's brand new, Grandma. Gracious, I ain't never seen no house like that. They, got, used, a, they got a cotton reef. I used to do a lot of work in this neighborhood. Yeah, that's a pretty house.
pretty brick. That brick yeah, forever. I ain't never seen some of these houses. I roofed that one right there, Hodge. That that guy works with Mama. There's a dead tree. That's a big old dead tree, ain't it? Yeah. We just riding around, chilling. Look, oh, there's a squirrel. Come on, squirrel. That's, that's what Dad and Mama spent the paint in their house like right, right here. <laughs> right. That's coming up, ain't it? Oh, I roofed that one too. Mm, I roofed that one. Uh, there's one right here that I roofed. Let me figure out which one it is. They got a swimming pool in the backyard. Make sure that's clear there. Looks pretty good to me. Man, when I was roofing that house, I bet they had 25 people over in the swimming pool. That woman was trying to invite me. That one right there. That's it right there. See that brick on with the fence? That woman was trying to get me to come swim, and I told her, I was like, huh, hey, I got to get some work done. Yeah, then. Do you see that house right there, Mom? Yeah. Do you remember the girl I used to go with named Rhonda? Got somebody behind you, brother love. That's where she used to live. Oh, okay. Working on it. Wow. That's good. You still eating that thing? Yeah. Man, grandma's getting her done. You didn't know road trip was going to include ice cream, did you? Uh -huh. I thought y'all were going to that other river. Like, told you right on into it. Ain't the Trinity School here? It sure is. I thought y'all were going to that other river. Then we got a private school here too, y'all. Yeah, for the low price of 40 grand, you can send your students there for the year. Christian school. Christian school. Shine down that way, too. Oh, yeah, that's to the school. You oh, can't see that. that I don't that. Yeah, somebody got up with a good idea. We're going to paint these things blue today. Oh. Went out there and picked it out. That's it. <laughs> That's the way I do. That's it right there. Yeah, that's 441. You're correct. That's the road we was on, y'all, when we turned off. This guy that lives right here is, used to be my school teacher. Who? What's his name? Uh, Mr. Waldrop. Oh, really? If I'd have known that, I'd have come out here and rolled this house. Would you? Yeah. That's her. Her? Yeah, that's I her. That was a man. You got it, my way. It is. What I'm referring to it is a, that's her. That's like, that's the bad boy, is what I'm talking about. Yeah. I wish I'd have known it. Guess what I got to drink, Grandma? I don't know. Root, root beer. Oh, I don't believe that about that. <laughs> Me and my buddies would have ride, ride by there and pay him a visit. There's some people do that on that road. Hell Green Road, every so often they roll by the house, they wrap it up. Oh, yeah. I'd, I'd be mad by that man. I'd put up me. Where's it? Yeah, something about wet. All over the trees. 
something about wet toilet paper. It's hard to get up, ain't it? seeing if we was paying attention. Oh, I did some work for this lady right here. She was real nice, like that lady right there. She's been a widow a long time. She told me she, she told me she has no interest in. And you ain't never gonna tell them about doing the roof with the woman had the skylight. Ah. Uh. He was in there looking in the, in the sky. <laughs> I was cleaning the skylight. Actually, when I do work, I clean them. I, this right here is Grandma Helen's daddy. Liv? I got pulled over. Somebody acts like they can't go around me. Well, what is that on the other side of the road over there? Look at them mad. Yeah, they mad, ain't they? Dang, quit that mess. I, I, I'll get out of this this thing in a minute. Instead, chase him, instead chase him of down, won't you? instead of them getting on over like a white person, they they like they they skint the side of your mirror a little bit when they went around you. I mean, if they did this, I had this thing <laughs> hammered down to the floor. You ain't gonna be able to turn in there now. You gonna have to go to the next. Well, he has a place to turn in. So how about y'all tell him who lives here? This is where Uncle William lives, Grandma's brother. My uncle. My daddy's house. Your stepmama lived here. Yep. Grandma, now this is it. Now, do you want to get out and show anything? Uh, where's we? You can't pull up to his shop. Well, is he up there? I imagine he's up here. I see your boat seat. See that big old piece of wood sitting under that shelter? Ain't even picked it up, has he? He probably needs some help picking it up. That sheet was rough. What kind of car is that over there with that white? With rusty bottom. A Lincoln Continental. My daddy used to have scuff in the bind. That is something still there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, remember when I see the gourd uh, things he built? Yeah. These gourds. Somebody blew the horn. Huh? Somebody just blew the horn. Oh. They was getting out of a car back there. Yeah. There is the scuffling vine. Yeah. Scuffling. Right there. He took some food in there. Let me show you how you. Where's the trash can back here? I'll show you how you greet Uncle William. Show you how he's. That might spill out in there. Nah, I'll show you how he's greeted me my whole life. We on a road trip. Come on in the palace. Miss Charlotte said, hey, Mr. William. Hey. Hey, Miss Charlotte. Is there any scuffing on that bike? Not now. Not now. They just getting right. They ain't that on there. How you know? Somebody. They didn't leave none? I don't think there's any out here. <laughs> I'll go see. 
Hey, there's one thing for sure that boat there don't leak. Uh, <laughs> that, that, don't does. that boat don't leak right there. Yes. You have to. You ain't gonna show everybody all this junk out here, are you? Nah, I'm gonna go make sure Grandma don't get on a snake. Because Grandma don't look. Ball, Grandma. What's that for? A uh, dog, I reckon. I don't see if there's any. Are you looking for a snake? see none on them, Grandma. I don't either. Let's go out here. Oh, look at the mushrooms. I wonder if them good to eat. Wonder? Yeah. I don't know the good ones from the bad. I don't either. Oh, gracious. Oh, I think he was right. Yeah, I don't see no scuffles on. What? Oh, what? Hey, the phone ain't gonna be able to take much of this. What? The heat. Oh. My phone will cut off in a minute. Well, let's get back in the. Oh. Yeah, you even got Sweet D out what here. What kind of dogs you got, William? They, they, uh, they Haven's dogs. They bulldogs, kinda. Maybe a little something else in there. Nikki, this is your camper, Uncle William. Yeah, the phone ain't gonna be here to take. Yes. My phone will cut off in a minute. It don't play. He's gonna show her the chickens. Yeah, that's a fig tree. Fig tree. It's full of water. I got to drain it out. Yeah, we'll come back tomorrow and watch it drain. Oh man, this. <laughs> hey, the the little building's gone, but it's right there, ain't it? Yeah, the dogs like get like to get in there. And cool off. Man. I got I have a, a dog. I got a big And we're you trying to run space for season. Yeah? We want to have enough of them out here. Oh, where's your chickens at? That's a syrup kettle. Yeah. That's the one my daddy used to make syrup. Hey, there used to be a there. little house right here. Dang. You know a little building. Oh, yeah. Watch this hole right here. What is it, Grandma? Is it, need to dump it over. Yeah, got, we, we're trying to show that it ain't got a hole in. Well, that's some red dirt, ain't it? That's right. I, I wouldn't have my chickens this far away from me. You wouldn't? No. 
Hey, we got some chicken eggs in there too. Oh, Lord. Y'all eat these eggs, William? Yes. Oh, that's a pretty one. What, what kind of is this? The, a wheat? Maybe some red. That right there. <laughs> they put in your incubator, hat. Yeah. Hey, we, we got a solid black chicken in there. I ain't never seen one like it. See, William, is these your chickens or Billy Joe? No, they Billy Joe. Oh. See that black one over there? He's yeah. solid black. Even. I like that one right there with the red. Salt and pepper. Uh-uh. That one running around. The furthest one back. Oh, okay. So y'all eating kind of food is Butter still spice. cheaper than the eggs is still? Well, I mean, it's kind of like a pet too, you know. I'm just saying, do you profit from the eggs? Uh -uh. Having to buy feed. Well, we might one day. Get the eggs keep going up. <laughs> That's peanuts right there. Uh -uh. There's coyotes and stuff out here, and they'll get, they'll get them. Well, uh, I let mine out, and they go right back in while I tell them to. I'm going to show them the way. Yeah. They like to eat green stuff. Yeah. What is that over there? I ain't never seen all that. That field back there? Yeah. That's our neighbors right here. They got all that land. What is that plant back there? I think that's peanuts. Oh, good. All right. Uh, we'll go get back in there. Here's some more chickens down here. Are we ready, Grandma? Yeah. I hate mm -hmm. not doing this to see you, but I ain't got time to. Hey, y'all, y'all making a big deal about my driving comment. That's just a comment. I ain't, they ain't mean nothing by it. Oh. <laughs> he, he had to go to the bathroom. Yeah, like, they ain't a mean, I don't have a mean intention in my body, y'all. Chickens. We got, can't put them with another rooster. Mm-hmm. Steven, that's the kind yours is little bantam like chicken. Boy, he got him a set of spurs on him. I think they call this one right here, I think they call him a round head. Look at the spurs on his feet, Grandma. Oh, good gracious. Yeah. Mine ain't got no spurs yet. How come their feathers is out? Uh, Did you see him do like Captain Hodges? He yeah. dropped his wing. Stick your finger down there, Steve. Did you see my video yesterday, William? Part of it. I let my my uh, rooster, I bought old metal mm -hmm. rooster. Yeah. And he walked up there and he put his wing down and he scratched his foot. And he jumped up there and, and knocked that thing down. He wanted to fight <laughs> that rooster. Did he? William, why you got all these Volkswagens? Uh, well, I got I got one. You know, there's one right there. That's mine. And then Billy Joe's got one. And then I was just wearing. Yeah, what was, you doing with all them votes? Uh, like? Yeah, know. I like that rooster. Do you? I'm probably gonna get rid of a bunch. I wish I had a rooster right there. Who am I there? We need a truck. This right here is definitely a game chicken. Yeah. I drove that truck out here. Come on, Steve. Steven, here's. Is these grown chickens, William? They are. They Steven, little bantam chickens. They, they bantams, too. Yeah. You ain't got but two? I think that's all they are in there. Come on, y'all got a they like, they like green stuff. All right, well, that's right. There's green edge truck, yeah. Steve. Sure is, ain't it? Lord, that man could ride. That's the truck he was driving. Yep, that's That it. man could ride and see everything. That was a hot rod right there. He liked that truck. 
Yeah, it had a big motor in it. This would be a good chicken pen. You could put some wire around it. Got a little Is that low to the ground? <laughs> yeah, they ain't got to be up high. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, show them Stephen Williams the pontoon ground. boat. Well, it's got a bunch of hubcaps in it. Danny ain't giving me a hard time about my pontoon boat. <laughs> Yeah, show him we got a pontoon boat. Y'all, he ain't fit. Hey, he's another man. Well, he's, he's a busy man. Don't, yeah, don't he's, mess with William. He's got a centennial here, Grandma. Y'all see, I had to stop and go buy lunch for everybody. I had to do that every day. And there's a pontoon we've been looking for. Yeah, I'll be back to give it this afternoon. There's his motor for the pontoon boat. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Hey, the phone. I it was the, front. the phone just cutting out. <sighs> Are we back? I knew. I knew the phone was gonna get hot out there, y'all. I'm, I'm live from the refrigerator. like a drink you know what's funny when you come alive from the refrigerator <laughs> they was going 80 miles an hour backwards yeah the car turned around yeah oh yeah she lost Got it back with William, Stephen. I had to go in the refrigerator. It cut off. It got hot. Hey, it is hot out here, y'all. I knew. Who? Stephen. <sighs> Can't afford another one. These things are expensive. Stephen, when you. William, when are you gonna finish my seats? I mean, my stuff for my boat. I'm gonna do it this week. You told me you was gonna do it Monday. Uh-huh. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> this old Martin cord thing still sticking back out there. I had a guy come here. Oh, there's two of them. Now he, four. Climbed, he climbed up the pole and bent the pole over. I wanted to Martin. I wanted to put new gourds on, and he climbed up the pole and bent the pole over, and then put the gourds on. I said, "Well, hey man, how are you gonna stand it back up?" He said, "I didn't think about that." Oh! I said, well, hey man, now the pole's bent, but I did take the forklift and kind of straighten it up a little bit. Yeah, that's kind of look what. Yeah, if I get some. Is this cloud getting? Cloudy looking. It looks good through this windshield on it. It looks like they're getting a little dark. It's, like it's it rains nice. every, it rains every day. It's nice and cool in here. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Nice and cool. We just it's, drove. We just. This camper gets colder than my house. Yeah, it does. We just drove through the Dairy Queen. No, with this. In this. Yeah, I went all in. the way around the building. We and went I, and got us an ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> I said, Danny, how you gonna get out? Oh, he was all confident. And then he got back there at the drive through <laughs> I mean, at the window where you're ordering, it was kind of close. Wasn't it, William? Stephen? It was. Danny's doing the same thing I'm doing. He's calling <laughs> William, Stephen, and me. <laughs> My mama used to do the same thing. Said William has a radio voice. Who said that? Miss Charlotte said William has a radio voice. Why don't you sit right there with him? 
Yeah, sit right here and I can get us all three in there. There you go. With my radio voice. <laughs> Oh, no. uh, this is what it's like in Georgia. Hot, yep. muggy. Danny said somebody's talking about moving here from Minnesota. Wasn't it Minnesota? Yeah. I done mowed three acres and y'all still having fun. Huh? Jim said he done cut three acres of grass. He come back <laughs> in, we still alive. I know it. I, it's got to be pretty long. Yeah. <laughs> He, he does have a nice voice. Long time ago, when we lived in the country, we didn't have no electricity. It had a radio, and I don't know how it run. It had a little wire you stuck out the window, because we didn't have no electricity. It had, what was it? I mean, how could it run? It had a big battery. Where it must have been. Off a of wire. We listened to the Grand Ole Opry, and we, Mama, and Daddy, and me, we sat there, and I was a little old bitty young. We sat there and look at that radio and hear that country music. We couldn't believe it, how it was coming out of that thing. And it was in Nashville, Tennessee. Y'all couldn't believe it. No, we, I mean. We, said your voice is soothing, we. Is it? What I said. They can listen to you talk all day. And you don't do much of it. I don't do much talking to them. No, and you don't do much videos, do you? I do. I'm trying to learn how to edit that video and I cannot figure this new system that they got out. What new system? It's like the, how you edit the video. It's, it's different than what it was when I wrote Grandma's it. Grandma's never seen that. Can William sing? Yes, he can. William can sing. Sing a little bit, both of y'all. What y'all want? Happy birthday? Yeah. Is anybody's right. birthday in here? <laughs> no, there ain't nobody's birthday. Oh, he, he did tell you did tell them people at the Dairy Queen it was my birthday, didn't you? Yeah, they gave her extra pineapple. <laughs> did they? Yeah. <laughs> and I eat every bit of it. All right, go ahead and sing. <coughs> sing, sing something you know. This is how they do. This is how they do me. Sing a rip when you're building something, and I like. My mind ain't on singing, but they put it on me. Yeah. Well, you sing one, uh, Stephen. Then he'll Look sing. at it. He'll sing one. Putting it on me right now. Well, go ahead. Yeah, Stephen, you sing. You sing one. Danny can <laughs> sing too. Oh, Danny can really sing. I know he can't play drums, but he don't want nobody to look at him. He just don't like can that. Can hey, he can play the flute too. He just had never cared to. A flute? Yeah. I'm short, fat, ugly, or stupid, Grandma. <laughs> well, you hush. I'm going to have to. Hey, that's somebody want to know how tall I was, how much I weighed. Oh. oh. Do Alan Jackson again. Stephen can do it. You ain't, well, this is on YouTube. Yeah. You ain't sing much. Yeah, they don't, they frown upon you singing on him. Do they? Yeah, they don't. Danny is a terrible guy. <laughs> yeah. Unless you get his order wrong at the restaurant. He is. He ain't out then. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I bet I had to slap somebody out here in front of your house. If they'd have stopped, I would have got out and slapped them. <laughs> oh, man. Well, I ain't heard no singing. Go ahead. Yeah, show me a, a short one, uh, William. I'm Stephen. Yeah, this is the first part of one. The first part of one. Yeah. Uh, there you go. <laughs> Do that one and. And, uh, <laughs> oh, shoot! Both of y'all do it. See how it sounds again. Go ahead and start. Do it. Get her done. <laughs> y'all funny. <sighs> you ain't get tired. Yes, yeah, burn. You prop it on that right there. I got an arm like a sumo wrestler, so it's heavy. Well, him. It's okay. You I got it. Get over there. Prop your arm. Well, shoot. I can't help no way. Why, well, y'all ain't singing. Grandma won't sing, sing. Stephen. And he'll sing with you. Yeah, sing I'll one, sing with you. Sing one he knows. Sing it, William. Miss Ellen said, sing it. And you gonna help him. One, two, three, and four. <laughs> 
Ah, baby, all I got is this beat of leather bag. And everything I own don't fill up half. Sing it. He might not know that, and I don't, I don't even know it. know it. What you know, William? Uh, he sung something while ago. Uh, hit, hit a little more of you, Stephen, in it. You got it. It's okay. It's okay. What song you know or want to do? I'm sure Air guitar. Ha, ha, ha. Yeah. Concert time. Hey, I'll go home and sing. I ain't scared of nothing. <laughs> you sure ain't. Hey, Stephen ain't camera shy at all, is he? Sing, sing one you were just oh. singing for William. Is it? He need to be he close. Said, uh, ain't no music he with said, him. baby, lock them doors and turn them lights down low. Oh. What's next? Play some music kind of soft and slow. We ain't got no place to go. I hope you understand. I've been feeling like this all day long. Oh, that might be enough for what you do. Yeah. Hey, so William could come out here when Stephen does the concert. Yeah, we'll do it. And sing. He can sing. Thank God I'm a country boy. Yeah. I mean, no, I'm not a country boy. <laughs> What would your daddy say about us if he was here? Oh, man. There's no telling. Would he have ever dreamed you'd be doing YouTube? Did? No. I got He's never dreamed that. Something I remember about him. Did he always have a knife and always, like, whittled on something? Is he who I'm thinking about that done that? He, uh... I don't think... He was he... primitive. He didn't know nothing about all this stuff like what we're doing right yeah, but I I come out here a lot, and there was always somebody out here that was like whittling with a knife on wood. <laughs> Had to be him. I don't, I don't know. I don't never remember him doing that. He's he always, was always sharpening a knife now. Uh, he did I, do that everything, a everything. He taught he Grandma had. how to sharpen hooks, fish. He sharpened hooks. He sharpened shovels. He sharpened whole hoes. Anything he had that he worked with, he, he kept it sharp because it, it would dig better and uh, cut better or whatever. Knives, but and I'm the same way. I keep every knife I got sharp. I got whittling files and, and, <laughs> and grinding boards. What do you call it? Uh, Great thing that you sharpen a knife on. What's it called that? Uh, a stone, wet rock. Yeah, wet rock. I got them. I learned a lot from my duty. Sharp stuff I, works a lot better. Yes, it does. But you know, those people that got the dullest shovels and dullest knives you can't <laughs> cut nothing with them. Uh, and borrow them and bring them back, though. Not at my house. They ain't gonna be sharp if I got them. <laughs> I wonder if Danny's stuff sharp. You always talk about my, uh, you always talk about my clippers when I get out there and cut and stuff outside. Oh, yeah. They ain't sharp, neither. It's shutting itself off, ain't it? Well, we better go then. <laughs> yeah, I think so. What time? I don't even know what time. Let me see. What time? It's 1.45. I'm, I'm missing me asking. You missing midget wrestling? <laughs> well, you sure ain't very upset over. <laughs> hey, we we love all y'all. Thank y'all for watching. Yes, thank you so much. Thank y'all for watching on the road trip today. Grandma, y'all stay tuned. Uh, William might come out. And Grandma's eighty-four. How old is her brother? They want to know how old you are, Uncle William. Uh, how old do I look? How old does he look? <laughs> that don't matter. <laughs> they say age is just a number. Age well, is just a number. How old are you? 61. 61. William can still slap somebody if he needs to. Yeah. <laughs> he, can, he, can, he can lift him up off their uh, 
Texas gal said Damn. 39. Texas gal. Yeah. We got good jeans. Right. 47. I heard them talking about you, Texas gal. Actually, that, that uh, fish and sweet. Grandma. <laughs> what was it? We got Sugar good. man. Sugar man loves her. We got good jeans. He said, we got <laughs> good jeans. Daddy. Daddy didn't have a bunch of gray hair when he died. And he didn't, wasn't bald either. He didn't, he didn't lose his hair. Look at William Turner, look like a movie star sitting there. Yeah. Look at, look at them blue eyes. Let me go up here and watch. Where he's at. There you go. <laughs> we got, look up here, William. You can't see my eyes, but look at his. We got the whole eyes. Blue eyes that come from my daddy. Yeah. That, that's where the blue eyes come from. My daddy had them, and uh, a lot in his family's got blue eyes. Most of his sisters and brothers had blue eyes. So, y'all got blue eyes or brown eyes? I like my blue eyes because I got them from my daddy. And the second set didn't have blue eyes. No. The second set? That's right. <laughs> that come from. And I got blue eyes. That come, he sure did. Blue eyes going to down. Uh, going around. from the key side. Key side. Yeah. That, they, do you know they were, we related to Francis Scott Key, yeah. my great, my grandfather. Yeah, I knew that. Yeah. A lot of people don't, don't know that, that we yeah. have that relationship. Grandma, Grandma. Stephen can sing, can sing a few words of the Star Spangled Banner, and then he starts humming Grandma. the parts he don't know. <laughs> Grandma, uh, <laughs> Grandma forgot we were signing off. Oh, I, that's right, I forgot. <laughs> Y'all, my Ooh, brown eyed girl. That's a good one too. Oh, I do like that song, but I like my blue eyes and I like William. La 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 la. You didn't yeah, know. Grandma, I didn't know if you got a spot right there where you dropped up. Ice cream. Good gracious. And now you'd have a bit of ice, ice cream. I can't take myself nowhere, Cameron. <laughs> Give me your water bottle. You want my water bottle? Get that me off. Grandma, that ain't as bad as the time you eat the steak with your hands. What? <laughs> Uncle William, you want a real plum? Hey, that's a real one right there. That's a real what plum. What y'all gonna do with it? You can have it. I brought it for Grandma and she yeah, didn't I want it. <laughs> we like the grocery store. I don't have to wash my shirt. Whether you need it to or not. Cause it got ice cream on it. <laughs> oh, goodness. Anyway. We had to go wake Grandma up, boy. No, they didn't. <laughs> We, we were signing off. Let's get back to where we was. We were signing off. Yeah. We enjoyed this road trip, y'all. I hope y'all didn't get too bored with us. We, we, we just enjoyed life and being, oh, yeah. being with our family and riding out here where William is. Yeah, they don't come see me often, but I'm glad they did. I'm going to come see if you don't get my seat, my upholstery done. <laughs> He's already wanting to slap somebody. I don't know if I can take it. <laughs> That's right. Somebody's about to get slapped in front of your house because they act like they couldn't come around him. Hey, I'm coming out here and whoop William all over this place out here. <laughs> oh, like you used to. <laughs> Thank y'all for everything you do. Yes. And being sweet and watching. Moderators. Thank you, moderators, for the good job y'all doing. I seen that bull jive in the chat a while ago. Y'all jumped right on that. Oh, you did? And when yeah. you going to be on again? I'll be on Thursday. What's today? Oh, Today's right. Wednesday, so I'll be on tomorrow at 10. Okay. And then you'll be on Friday at 10. Yeah. William be on week. When you going to be on week? I'm going to be on uh Sometime this week. Sometime this week. <laughs> oh, it's good to see y'all. Have a blessed day. Yes, and be kind to people that's less fortunate. That's right. Give be kind. A, give them a smile and a kind word. And I'm gonna say, don't, don't push them around just because you can. Yeah, if they don't right. have enough change at the register, reach in your pocket, and give it to them. I do that all the time. <laughs> okay, y'all. Bye bye. Y'all have a good day. We'll see y'all later. Bye. <laughs> bye bye.